Hey there folks, how's it going? How's everybody doing today? Welcome to their Stu's Game Reviews live stream. Today we're hopefully going to continue the um, game James Bond, 007 James Bond, The Stealth Affair, which was created by Delphine Software out of France and published by Interplay. It's a point-and-click adventure where you play James Bond, and I talked about the whole crazy story about that last time. I'm hopefully here again today with the Gamer's Grotto. Um, I think he went to get a drink. I'm not sure if he's back yet, so if he comes back, he'll, he'll say hello, I'm sure. Um, probably have to raise his audio up, too. Let me do that. There we go. Um, this game so far has been very, very weird. Um, we learned that you need to operate the ground in order to get solve some puzzles. Like, that's, the interface of this game is, like, horrendous. I mean, that's the, that's the main issue so far is the interface is really terrible. You have to operate ground... You have to uh, do all sorts of crazy things. I'm going to start the stream on Twitch, too, although I'm not going to really pay attention to the Twitch one today. I'm just going to let it go. Hey, Ben, is he there here again? If he if he's here, yeah. I mean, I think he's. I think he went to... Uh, no, I'm, I'm, I'm here. I'm just... Uh, give me a sec here. Um, but I'm... No, I'm, I'm going to be here for it. <laughs> I, I, I was about to say, I think he went to take, a, like, a piss or something, but... Uh, Anyway, he looks like he's here, so the Gamer's Grotto is indeed in the house, Ben, and welcome to you as well. And, uh, what was I going to say? Yeah, the inter so we, we solved, we, we got, we, we captured twice as James Bond already. The first time we got out of a, of a cave by operating the ground twice, then getting a pickaxe, excuse me, <laughs> well, hold on one second. Part of the fun of coming on my streams is seeing me randomly start to sneeze uncontrollably. So sorry about that. I don't know where that came from. It's it's okay. We know you're allergic to this game. We all are. <laughs> I think I'm allergic to a lot of these games. <laughs> <laughs> so then we got a pickaxe, and then we used it to break a, a random place in the wall by I think operating the wall or something like that. I don't know. And then we had a second puzzle where we were we were thrown overboard. And the solution to that puzzle was to first buy an inflatable bracelet from a homeless man, which I assume, when they say inflatable bracelets, like one of those things you wear, like little babies wear on their wrists when they go swimming. And so before you got tied up, you inflate the thing. And then after he ties you up, you deflate it. And then you're able to slip out of your bonds. And uh, no pun with bond and bonds, but like, how the hell would that possibly work? Because if somebody saw you have this like this floaty on your arm, they wouldn't tie a rope around it. They would just take the freaking floaty off your arm. I mean, like, the game is supposed to be like some kind of parody or something. It makes no sense at all, bottom line. Oh, also, we keep running into these these um, these uh, evil guys with gigantic, huge, like, monster arms, like, like you know, like ten times the size of my arm. It's like this guy is like, you know, I don't know, Trogdor or something. And, like, I don't know what the hell's going on with that. So, like... I can explain. The The French creators saw Hulk Hogan and thought that all Americans look like that. These guys is bigger than Hulk Hogan. It's, like, <laughs> it's like I think twice the size of Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> it's pretty messed up. All right. I, last time, in the last stream, I hit restart by accident and messed up the, the game. So, first, let's get back into the game. Then I'm going to try to reload it from wherever the heck I was. And we get to see, again, the ridiculous Kai protection... If Yay! I can click on the goddamn thing. More coloring books. Here we go. Yeah, basically it's a coloring book. It's like paint by numbers. All right, so I gotta look in the in the manual and see what that stupid thing is lit up. What's it? What's it colored in the manual? And it looks like it's black. And you gotta get this right twice. If you get it right only once, then you're out of luck. All right, so black. That and then clicking it once doesn't work apparently. All right, and then that stupid thing, <laughs> best part of the game, I always sleep. That's purple, I believe. Oh, you can see it too. 
Tech. There we go. It's Perfect. almost like Q just hands him this book and is like, 007, I'm colorblind. Before you go on your mission, <laughs> tell me what color these are. Basically. Yeah. And look how long it takes to freaking load. All right, let's see. Now, I, I can't, I don't think you can skip the intro sequence. I'm pressing F10. But who's this guy, D. Maurice? Is he proud of himself? Like, because he should be. That's a, that's a weird, uh, that's okay. So Delphine Software was the creators of Flashback and stuff like that. That is a weird intro for them, how it's so slow and everything. Well, I mean, they also did, like, Out of This World, right? So, like, there is yeah. some, like, oh, here we go. Okay. Oh, <laughs> look, let me bring up this thing. I, oh, I got to change. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, hold on. Let's try it again. Backup drive is A. I can see. Okay, go ahead. Okay, now restore game. All right, thank God. All right, what was what was <laughs> what was the last save game? <laughs> um, was, well, I, I'm assuming it would be who is auto. No, I don't think so. I think I looped back into the top part here, and I was. So try stew. So try the first stew. Let me try stew four first of all. Okay, it's not this one for sure. No, I think, I, th it was I think it's two, two but I, but I want to load two, three first to make sure. This is why I always name my save games related to where okay. I am. Definitely not this one. What happened to the music, by the way? Oh, jeez. <laughs> it's two, Dr I, I, it's I, this I, one. Do you remember how hard it was for me to get to her before the time ran out? So I gotta do this again now. That wasn't your last save. It was. No, it was when you when we saved right right when you were um when we were in the truck. No, I was trying to save and I hit re and I hit, and I hit uh, restart by accident. Right. Oh shit. <laughs> All right, let's do this again. Such, <laughs> such nice music too. Nothing says romance like drowning. What do I gotta do again? Operate. Her like chest or something. I forget. Operate the girl. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Operate that kind of games, dude. Examine girl. Girl. Is there another hot spot? Does it use something? Use. No, I think it was just just use her. I think it was operate, wasn't it? I mean, it's too late now, but this this this, this part really sucks, and I got stuck here. Operate her, but she's pretty close. So why say it's a waste of time? Like. Okay, I probably I probably do it fast enough though. I think we're gonna die. They go, they, they swim like really slowly, like they synchronized swimming, you know, like it's like the Olympics or something. I'm not gonna make it. I'm sure I'm not gonna make it. There should be villains at the, the very top of this. Like to shooting like you? A, to give no, to give you like scores, like nine point five. <laughs> not gonna make it. Come well, on, you bastard, get up there. Oh, he man. swims about as good as I would expect Leisure Suit Mary to swim. Go, go, go! Oh, he actually made it, holy cow! With one <sighs> second to spare. And there's Popeye and Sailor Man. Do you want to do the, do the voices? Uh, uh, do a Popeye do, voice. I, oh, I don't think I can do Popeye. Julia, thank God we finally found you. Get in quick. I don't know. <laughs> that was probably nothing. Yeah. <laughs> uh, good, 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 good. <laughs> yeah. Well, blow me down. Yeah, I can't do it either. Yeah, no, it's a really hard voice to do. I had a friend who did it perfectly, but... Uh...
My dad I've could do Donald been. Duck, and I cannot do it for the life of me. Oh, God, that's another hard one. Julia, you took a dangerous risk trying to take on Otto single-handed. Oh, I have we'll to do, the, I have to do the, the female voice, and then it goes, We'll see about that. Oh, I, I, I was supposed to be more breathy. We'll see about that later, Tonio. Let me choose a friend, Mr. Bond. Look how I walk. <laughs> I owe you my life, senor. I hope I can pay you back someday. And you know what I mean when I say pay you back, right? <laughs> then call me James, and let's not talk about it anymore. That was a pretty good show, Kyrie James. Welcome to our side, senor. The movement for the liberation of Santa Paragua. We owe a lot to you. You have just saved the life of the niece of Presidente Manigua. She is our only hope to demask the imposter that passes for her uncle. <laughs> yes, the president has... Oh, no, I think it's still the guy at the top. Is it the guy at the top or it's the girl? I don't know. Like the, the the dialogue tree is so strange on this. It's not definitely not James Bond. So it's probably the girl then. <laughs> Always seems that the stream know. came ages twenty one plus thanks to my voice. Oh, you think it's the girl? Fine. Yes, the president has acted differently since Otto came. He's changed his mind on certain civil rights that he would have supported before. My family was his first victim, and I am the only one who is still free. We think that Julia's uncle is still living and that he is being held in the palace. Everything's ready, Tonio. We can begin. <laughs> Good. The Presidente is organizing a show at the palace. That would be an ideal occasion to infiltrate there disguised as a performer. Bye-bye. <laughs> it, just, it just leaves. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, get out. I'm done talking, bye. You can take my truck I use for cattle. It's, no it's save very here. nice. You can't even save. That's probably how I got screwed up last time. It's, it's because it's a cutscene. I know, but... This is how we treat all our actors. They are cattle. <laughs> yes, triumph the insult comic dog. That's hey so kid, funny. kid! <laughs> Triumph the Insult Dog. I love Triumph the Insult Comic Dog, man. He's the best. <laughs> After many long hours in the big jungle. <laughs> Triumph is pretty funny. Who does Triumph? Is it Robert Spinal? Yes, yes. He's also the creator of Triumph. Robert Smeagol, yes. Um... He is Robert Smeagol. It's Smeagol, I think. No, it, well, I don't think so, because um, he was on uh, an episode of Larry David playing himself, and Larry David called him Smeagol. Jim, the music in this game is so off in general. Like, we were just drowning before, and there was, like, terrible, like, upbeat music. Yeah, right? Shouldn't be a, a, This is all over. Or here's a soldier place, I guess. Are they just gonna crash? Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I thought they were gonna just plow through. This is this, this music is loud too. Oh, sorry, what? I can't hear you. My head drums blew out. This little cutscene, my God. Is this an opera? James Bond, the opera. Oh, it's a magic show. I still can't save the freaking game. Senor Presidente, ja ladies and gentlemen, I wish to present Magic Act Famous all over the world. An act that only I, the famous Rudolfo, am able to uh, perform on Earth or anywhere else. What? Wait, hold on. What? <laughs> Clap. Yay! On Earth? Rudolfo, you said it's like Triumph, but we still like you. Yeah. I mean, I can do Triumph. Exactly. Is that me? Is that Otto? I don't know. Hey, look, he's taking his head off. You see that? <laughs> <laughs> Every time he bowed, his head disappeared. Yeah. What's he doing now? Like, look, look, look at their heads. I like the comic book <laughs> clapping. 
Their heads are disappearing. No, it's supposed to be them bowing. I, I, I know, but like the art, the, the really bad animation. And she wow. disappeared. Clap, clap, clap. Wait, what's, what's going on here? Can I save now? Uh, this is fucking brilliant. It. Is that supposed to be me? Get, can what? I get my money back for this movie? Why am I on stage? <laughs> I don't know. I don't, I don't The whole box either. disappeared. It's like a Mario Brothers question mark box. Oh, that was brilliant. 10 out of 10, best magic show. <laughs> There's one freaking trick. Always asleep. We would like your input. <laughs> you, you rate this. Do you rate this magic show game of the year? No, it's magic, magic show of the year. Magic show of the year. <laughs> magic show of the year. <laughs> hey, Johnny Bond. Help! Help me, Jims. I, I forgot the voice. That was going too fast. So those Trogdor guys capture her. Oh no. Julia, where are you? <laughs> You're a little more concerned all, than that. All I see is darkness. Who wanted the two of you? What? Who? Still can't. Oh, I, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. You still can't save. I don't think. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? <laughs> Between the two of you is the most wanted. The hell's this? It is Pac Man. <laughs> what? What's this here? Uh, it's a maze, apparently. You have to get, you have to probably get the key. You came in? Can I use the arrow keys? I can't. I guess you have to click. Oh, wow. Oh, this my God. is gonna be fucking ridiculous. Now I understand when What's His Name was in here and said this puzzle sequence is retarded, the upcoming one. Would be this one. Oh, I mean, how, how, why did that work? Uh, you, uh, you, you, uh, clo it's too late. It in time. Yeah, you closed, didn't close it in time. I'll try it again. I don't give it a chance. Like, your mission's over. Monkey Island 2 stole this sequence? Which one? This stupid maze thing that I'm in? I don't think so. I don't remember that being a Monkey Island 2. Which of the two is most wanted? This game was weird. I want to try to trap him back there, this Trogdor guy. That actually worked that time. Ah, oh, loser! You can't forget again! Oh, you suck, buddy! Ah, ha, ha. Okay, you know what? This is actually not that hard. Well, if all I, you if, need to do is... If I have no time limit and I can trap it. people and stuff. Yeah. That's all you need to do. Is this just is all these, Matthew. Into, <laughs> so, so this guy coming up, when he goes off to yeah, the well, right Yeah, when he goes to the right, I'll, I'll trap him yeah. in there, obviously. Yeah. This is actually pretty easy. So far, it's not an action sequence. It's like a puzzle sequence, which I'm okay with. Yeah. Oh, actually, that's not true. He, he can still come at me. I don't know if you realize that. He has to go like a little bit further distance. Yeah, no, no. He... Uh, but he's an That's idiot. See, he's going. He's well, going. I'm also an idiot, around. so. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going. Uh -oh. Uh oh. I'm in trouble now. Oh no, I'm not. Somebody got lucky. Not sure what I did. No, no, no! Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. <laughs> Alright. You said that your mission is over, it's you mission is over. I'm gonna have to do this, uh, and save incrementally, I guess. It's because they're, they're Spanish or whatever. Your mission right is on. over! Jim says, this feels, yeah, Johnny Bond says, double said gave me the henchman mano a mano. You can see how big that guy's muscles are? I mean, like, that's, you're right. I mean, in the movies, he'd find a way to take that guy out. Jim says, it feels a lot like a game was developed. The developer got a hold of James Bond license, tried to rent a fifth Jim, that's exactly what happened, actually. Yeah. That, that's, that's exactly, that's exactly the story of this game. 
Yeah. It's called Operation Stealth in the UK. And Interplay got the James Bond license and slapped it on top of it. So you're absolutely correct. See, I thought I could trap this guy in here, but it didn't work. Why did it not work? It, did, it seemed like we could trap him in, but we didn't. I mean, that's the problem. We did not trap them. You know, we both thought we were very clever, and we didn't actually trap him. That does not actually trap him. It's part of the problem here. When I did that, it also changed something else. That guy's just moving back and forth up there. How do I get him to leave? Uh -oh. Run! Run! That was sort of lucky. Oh no, no, get out of there. No! Shit. There's some kind of Pac-Man logic here, by the way. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it! Oh! I was so close. There's some kind of Pac-Man logic there, the way they just think move. Jim, you really you knew that, didn't you? I'm sure you I'm sure you knew that already. You just like saying that now like, to make yourself sound smart. Ugh, I should I, I I they don't behave like the way I would expect them to. Freaking like Pac-Man ghosts. I wish I could trap the ball. I could trap the first guy. You're right, but I screwed it up. I got nervous, Johnny. You see how nobody's by the key right now? Then they go to the key later. I think that's wrong. I think I did. I think I did it better the first time. Shoot, that's not bad. When I push one, it pushes multiple ones. I noticed. It's not just one. Seven, oh, seven use the force. Yeah, I'm in trouble. Damn it. Shit. It's hard. It's funny because when you start it off, it looks so easy. And then I know. I got I'm gonna have to save it. I'm gonna save an interim this time. I'll just, I, I should I should have done that last time. What's with this music too? Always asleep loves us. <laughs> I wish I could be let you do it always asleep. But you see when I push one, it pushes other ones too. It's there. They're not like individually, too. I believe you, Jim. I was just kidding around. I mean, you're very, you're very astute.
Do I get back here? Like, what am I even doing? Like, that's the other thing. I went to a magic show, right? I ended up in a tunnel or something. But it doesn't explain, like, how, like, what I'm doing here. So, okay, so, do you remember when you guys both went into that, uh, magic thing and it disappeared? Yeah. It, it, you're, you're, you were teleported to this area. Right, but why? I'm just gonna assume that the Like, what is this area? Why, why am I getting a key? Gonna, I'm just gonna assume, assume that the magician's a bad guy. Okay, well, that may be true, but... Yeah. And I, I'm assuming that the key is to get the hell out of here. Because as soon as you get the key, it opens up with like a stairwell. So it's a key for a locked door, essentially. How did he catch me? That was bullshit. That was bullshit. Yeah, Excuse the, me. The, the biggest problem with this is that if this were a real James Bond type thing, he would have a gun on him. He wouldn't just be wandering around. Right, exactly. Like through all this crap. Yeah, it, 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 I was supposed to get a gun for my contact. I never got a freaking gun. It, it's like, oh, there's a person coming up behind me. It's a good thing I've got my gun. But, like, in this case, it's just Pac Man. I want to go this way. Oh no! I didn't realize the guy was right behind me. I wasn't paying attention. Damn it. <laughs> Where'd he come from? I didn't see that guy coming, you man. No, uh, Jim, it's only letting him use the mouse. Yeah, I tried with the keyboard. <laughs> I tried. It does not work. Well, at least we move the, the, the arrow with the keyboard. <laughs> That's about it. It's amazing, but I should be dead. No, 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 no. <sighs> Damn, I was hoping they would they wouldn't catch me. It's so hard, like Imagine pack me with like fifty ghosts too. Yeah, stairs would appear, I know. If I get I gotta get to the stupid stairs. Oh, he's not going through. See, I thought I could trap him, but he went through the door. You saw that? Oh boy. Well, we'll do, we'll get this eventually. Seventeen hours later. I I almost hit it one time, so I know that this is the right track. Just it's, it seems like a lot of it's random. Like, if that guy's hanging out where the key is, like, what, what can I possibly do? He's, like, just hanging there. Oh, I see. I gotta do that with it. I, I just realized something, actually. I just realized something. I just realized something. I'll show you what I realized. I gotta open... I just... I figured something out, actually. So I do my brain here. I'll show you. I can't open this gate because it opens one of the right two. I can only open it when this dude here is on the right side. If he's on the left side, then he ends up getting me. And now, look! 
Come on, he went through it. That was cheap. I don't want to die, but I should have died. This is, nah, this is just this is BS. I can't win like this. You see what happened? Like he went through the gate. I knew what to do that time. I, I figured it out, basically. One more time. So you can't trust them. Alright. Go this way. You go to the right, go to the right, go to the right. Oh, no, again, again, he walked through it. They're really weird patterns of walking, these guys. So they got me that time, but like... It's interesting. They hug the walls, they do weird things. Jim says you probably uh, flipped the gate too soon. I, I, or maybe too late. I, I mean, yeah. One or the other, but like, that was really annoying. It's like lock and chase or whatever. It's too late, not too soon. I feel like I can try to recover, but like... I mean, I might be able to recover, actually, because look at this. I got a good situation here, too. Where there's only one guy who can get me right now. I'm a little bit faster than they are. It's my only advantage. <laughs> In fact, I'm gonna save the game right now. You have time to trap the third guard to prevent from coming down. I'm not loading my save game, I'm saving. I mean, I thought they were getting out, though, because this guy is just patrolling up and down. Right there. I guess I have to go when he's... Okay. Maybe that little ditch there is where I have to go. If I can get there. No, 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 not like that. Not like that. By the way, I'm pretty sure after you beat this, there's another another board. <laughs> See, I thought we didn't go in there. Now we went in there. What I, what I didn't need it to. Yeah, I think this is the puzzle that uh, that one dude in the last stream was talking about, where he he beat the game and he said it gets really hard. Which and I think I think I think he did say that there's multiple of these. You see that? Why does he walk through the freaking wall? He yeah, he clipped through the wall. Bastard. I guess he's so strong that like <laughs> It almost feels like their arms are clipping through the wall. Oh, this is kinda of heavy now. Uh huh. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> they followed me.
Oh my god. Where am I going now? There's less guards in this biz. Oh, this looks like so much fun. Then keep your glue handy. Oh, it's only down. Okay. <sighs> Look at this craziness. Fat ass bond. My question is how the hell did Interplay write this off? It, it's like. Uh, is it James Bond game? Just as a game in general, why, why, why did they go? Oh, this seems like a good game to make public for America. Um, like, yeah, it's it's interesting. Does Interplay it's generally at a very high level of quality? Right, exactly. But they're probably like, I mean, you know what? No, Stone Keep, Star Trek. These uh, guys made, uh, you know, Out of This World. That was okay. So hopefully, this other shit they made is good too. I'm assuming it's still like that. Uh, yeah, maybe that's it. Uh -huh. Without actually, without actually looking at it. If I just get past that one asshole, then I'm free and clear. I should be able to go around him. In fact, I, I feel like if I screw this up, it's my own fault. This, so, <laughs> jo Johnny, this is not the reason Interplay is not around anymore. <laughs> this is it's not this game. Trust me. <laughs> at least you can save during this thing. Interplay had a way. lot of Interplay had a lot of really good games after this one. So long, Trogdor! Yes. Yes. Nice. We're actually. Is that me? Somewhere. Oh, okay. I thought that was like a cutscene. <laughs> no, that's you. I think you just walk somewhere. I would say, yeah. This is like a good name for this backup here. <laughs> Jesus. Oh my goodness. All right, so I guess I just came out of this door. Now what? Where the hell am I? Well, we're walking so slow all of a sudden. Can't go there. Can I go this way? No. What? <laughs> oh, great. Am I supposed to go with this door? I Yeah, I guess so. That's kind of weird. Should I operate the door? It's opening! Oh, that's where I came from. That's right, it was Matthew who was uh, playing this. I think you. I think Matthew, you were the one who told him about these puzzles. You're about where I stopped playing years ago. That's not good. <laughs> that means it's about to get worse. Where the hell am I? What, what, what's going on in this game anymore? I don't even know what's happening anymore. We're back to like an adventure game somehow. In in fairness, I didn't know what was going on in this game all along. Is that a book? Improve your communication skills. Yeah, I don't know. Either. Take take book. Yeah, what can I take whatever I want to take? Take book. So maybe I can only take certain books. Maybe it's one of those revolving books. Dynamic deterior oh with power weapons by Jill and Manigua. There's so many books here, like I can't see what I'm, I'm highlighting. The check was got in time travel and towels. Uh, what? Oh. Matthew says statue arm. Well, I, I mean, I was I wanted to look at every single book in the bookcase too. I guess not. Matthew, give me don't don't give me don't spoilers unless I'm stuck. I remember, I like I just, just walked into this room finally. Operate the chair. No. Examine. Pencil case, lamp, chair, desk pad, office, telephone, inkwell. Oh my god. 
Do I use the phone? Wait, what? ST format, ST magazine. format magazine called the, the Atari ST version number one best adventure game in 1990. Well, what? ST was probably all. What, why is he walking so slowly, too? This never this didn't happen before in the game, did it? All of a sudden, he's like slow as molasses. Operate desk pad. No, he doesn't want to do that. Operate. The interface is so bad. That's the main yeah. problem here, honestly. Take pencil case. No need. Take. Is your pencil? No. Operate pencil case. The results. Examine inkwell. What's what do I have all these items for if I can't take any of them or use any of them? That magazine burnt down shortly after that review. Either that, yeah, either it burnt down or or the uh the the guy who uh said it was number one best adventure game in nineteen ninety probably got sacked. When, when Jim, <laughs> when did the Atari ST like basically like, you know, stop being a, a use, useful machine. The magnificent statue of the dais. Mm. What's a dais? Or the arm is kind of funny looking. Okay, it's actually give me a hint about the arm. The magnificent statue's arm. All right, so uh, Matthew, I could have figured this out without you. So I'm doing no now. Oh, his pants came off. What happened? Oh, a safe. Oh, God. Okay, I don't have this, the safe cracking doohickey thing. Why did it put me right into this screen where I can't do anything? How do I exit? Okay. I, uh, do I still have my briefcase? No, I don't. What was the, uh, the item that... This is save. What was the item that cracked saves? I think I had something like that. Uh, the safe cracking box. So it's probably the uh, that stupid box I got. Yeah, but, but I guess Jim, my point is like there probably weren't so many adventures that were on the ST in 1990. But we yeah, are wrong about that. Yeah, it's the it's the little box, it's the code breaking box. Yeah. Named after the cracker. <laughs> right. 003 used to use it or something, right? Use little box on safe door. Okay. Is that a little box? What are you supposed to do here? I can't even fucking see it. What are you supposed to do? It doesn't even say. Oh, okay. I understand. You have like two seconds to do all this, apparently. Just press buttons and then hope that you get the right combination. Oh, I switch it on. Alright, Jesus. So eight is good. Oh, it makes the same things pop up. Huh? I don't, I'm doing the wrong thing here, but I, I'm trying to understand what this is. Eight seems to always make two and four light up. It's a real puzzle of some kind. What if? Uh, hang on, hang on. So go go back to the beginning again. 
Because I think those lights are lighting up in the order that they're supposed to be, maybe? Oh. Wow. Let me think. Eight is two and four. Oh, you're probably right. Yeah. <clears throat> That's my assumption, anyway. <laughs> I got it wrong. Thanks for being here, Ben. You have a good night. I think you, I think you figured it out, though. You suck, loser. Ha ha ha. Okay, let's see that again. You. Ben says, "May the force box. be with I'll you." See her. Yeah, Ben. Have a good night. So one should be the first letter according to this. I'm not sure that's right, but four. Oh, so it's actually changed, interestingly enough. And then seven of the two middles. So it changed from from last last save. If that's if you're right, which I think you are. Yeah, that would be my assumption. There we go. Yeah. Uh. Did you flip it off before it could finish? I thought I, th I, mean, I thought that I'm trying to get into the safe, and if that's the right number, then that's all we need to do. S so yeah, I did flip it off. <clears throat> um. I didn't, I didn't flip it off, by the way. <laughs> I switched it off. This difference. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's, flip a, it off. <laughs> that's the Canadian in me, eh? We we call it flipping off a switch. What do what? What did I do wrong? I don't know. I I almost feel like when you switched off, switched yeah, it off it before it was finished. Oh, Matthew oh. says take box. Jeez. Oh, can I open the door? Oh god. Why? Why? Why does that control whether I can open the door or not? Because the, the, the safe door goes down. I know, but that's so stupid. It start going down and then say it can't go because the box is in the way. All right, here's the wow. documents that I supposedly wanted so much. What did it say? It takes coded documents. Okay, whatever. Take it contains photos of your ex-wife. <laughs> I don't want photos of my ex-wife. I knew it! I knew it! Of course! The world is small, Mr. Bond! Karpov! Is Kasparov here, too? <laughs> no, Mr. Ostrovich! I was going to say Mr. Ostrich. <laughs> no names, idiot! No names! Give me the envelope, Mr. Bond. Hello, gentlemen. It must be a family reunion. May I join you? So that's auto, apparently. <laughs> it looks like me. Is that the idea? It's I like, don't. Hey, you want, you want an envelope? Or can I give you a foot up your ass instead? C catch them? What, what? What's going on here? Did, did they shoot this guy? <laughs> This is so stupid. No, Bond, Bond punched him. Bond punched Catch him? Them. I want them dead or alive. Hopefully dead. So Bond punched him and the Thiago flew up in the air and the other guy caught it? The and other guy the caught door? it and, and yeah. <clears throat> yeah, just a bit, eh? Bond, Bond's terrible. What the hell's going on? No, 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 no. <laughs> Almost, I'm trying to save the game. Try to start the game again. <laughs> I guess because I'm trying to. See, what's going on? They're like running around the floor now. Just wait until the cutscene's over, dude. I know, but I want to save because last time they gave me no chance. Like for all I know, it'll oh, be like you're back dead. In the fucking back in the fucking water again. You can't save right now, anyway. There's only restore. It's I'm chasing with a boat now. This bot sucks, as Johnny Bot. Oh my god! See, look at this now. This reminds me of Space Quest 1. The yeah, Astro. I know. It's the exact same shit. So you're just dodging things. 
I already got hit once, twice. What are those sharks? How do, how do I move? What's going on here? Use the arrows, maybe? I can't. But I click it, it doesn't even move. What's the deal here? This, this is, um... What's that here? Is this still game of the year for you, uh, always asleep? I'm stuck, I can't move now. He's stuck. Go, do something. What the hell is that? I can't even control it. Hold on, what? What did that just say? Almost got it, but almost only counts in grenades and... Horseshoes and hand grenades. Right. Why is he, why does he keep pulling more in the middle? What's, what's going on here? No matter what I do, he goes back to the middle. What's, what's happening? If, if now, this he's stuck, is top now he's stuck here. This part of the game he's stuck in. Now I can move a little bit. Ow. Ow. Just to get him now or something? I don't... What am I supposed to do? I can barely control it. This is your favorite top tier Bond game. No, he's just, he's be, he's, I think he's being a little bit <laughs> facetious there. No, I know. I was going to say, uh, don't, to ever the, play, don't ever play Gold. Arrow keys, don't seem to do anything. I mean, like, literally, I'm being hit by every single. Look, I'm not touching it there. happened well there you go after several minutes of vicious fighting you are able to overpower blah 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 this isn't the right moment to hang around since Otto has sent his men after you you jump into your water scooter oh do you have to do more <laughs> we go oh, oh, oh yay <laughs> now you have to do it in reverse <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> I used to love Goldeneye, but it is hard to get back to after this. Yeah. I don't even know. I have no idea how to control this at all. I, I would say just. Oh, but just be the shit out of me. Is there anything in the instructions about this? This game sucks. <coughs> this game sucks. How? I don't under what I don't understand is how how people beat this game. That's what I don't understand. Do a little dance here. This is wild. Ow. Oh, music stopped. Did you win? Yep. I thought I did, too. <laughs> oh. But no, no such luck. <laughs> no RC case sequence, no hints. <laughs> oh, my God. What? Why? All right, like, I, I was trying to get the hit, which was to do here, at least. I had to avoid them necessarily, but at least what you're supposed to do. They're all, that's how they were all in the front. How much to avoid them? Oh my god. Jokes aside, though, always asleep, what is your favorite Bond game? <clears throat> Obviously, it's not this one, but I mean. Do you think this is worse than Should We Scramble? Oh, <laughs> I'm not I so mean, sure. Yeah. Oh, what? What? Wait, no, wait a second, I, my life didn't even run out that time. Did you see Shibuya, that? Shibuya Scramble was at least uh, tolerable. This this is... Um, this is worse, isn't it? 
Oh yeah. Oh, oh definitely. No, this is just bad coding is what this is. Yeah, I can't go backwards and forwards. Like, what did I do here? Go on top of you, they like they rape you to death. I feel like you're not gonna be able to finish this game. How many arcade sequences did I play right today? Oh, oh. hold on. Can you can you click backwards maybe? Oh shit, hold on. Maybe the, uh, hold on, can you do it the exact same angles that they do? Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I know what you're saying. I'm trying to see if I can survive by as high as you're low enough. It's like, it's like it doesn't even show I'm... all, your, all your, your life go away. This classic Sierra had an online 90s. No, I, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't say that. In the no. Sierra games, you at least do what you're supposed to do. Yeah. This is not like Sierra. This feels more like LucasArts, but really bad LucasArts. With... This is not anything like a Sierra game. It's more, this feels more like a LucasArts game, like very early LucasArts. Like, uh, uh... How did I get back there? Alien Mindbenders, whatever it was called. Zach, Zach McCracken. Mc, Zach McCracken, yeah. I'm trying to figure out what to do. Matthew, you don't know what to do? Hey, Stars Man, he has it going. <laughs> Where is she? There were first, there, some of the Sierra games had, had sequences like this, but... No, um... No Sierra games were like this. So the 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 first part where he was uh, dodging, trying to dodge those things coming at the Sea Dew, um, that was kind of like a sequence in Space Quest One. Uh, when you were going to Ulenti Flats, um, you had to uh, dodge uh, rocks on the uh, the skimmer. Did the music stop? But like it doesn't mean anything. The music no, stops. I think it, I think the music stops and just loops. Like it stops and starts again. Survive. <laughs> Do you need tips, Matthew? Try to survive. Matthew, you want to plug your YouTube channel while you give me the tips? I can't survive. I don't know what to do. Oh, oh, oh. Are you? Yeah, you might be right. What? As far as Manny says, maybe it doesn't follow the mouse pointer, but it follows the mouse movements. Well, I can control it a little bit now, but I don't know what to do. So you, it's like I, I have the control is so yeah. poor. Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade, I can see it graphically anyway, but Indi even Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade wasn't this bad. The control is just really poor. That's all. Did you ever see if you can go in in the in the rear? Um, I'll try. Because I'm almost wondering if when they go up front, you go up be up in the back. You go to channel. You show the channel. Can I go back? I can't. I click on the back, does nothing. No. Click on the front, does nothing. It's hard to, remember, it's hard to even figure out, honestly, which no. one is me and which one is them. Always, always look, asleep with the pro tip. Don't let them hit your water scooter. Look, like, okay. all these sprites look the same. The only difference is I have, like, a like a light blue lapel or something. It's your tuxedo. I know, Shaking, but it's not skirt. Aside from that, I look the same as the rest of them. I think he was joking, Matt. I don't think he was being serious. Oh, get out of here. The thing is, like, they, they, they hit you so many times in one shot. You don't have any invincibility frames or anything. Indy was also awesome into this. Yeah, but you see, the castle party at Jones, there was a way to do it. With using your brains, you can beat that whole thing without throwing one punch. Yeah, no, Except I agree. For the drunk this, guy. This, this just feels buggy. This just feels like buggy. Um, I don't know. I'm not. I'm not impressed with this at all. And again, they keep getting me without without me running out of health. Is there is somebody? Is there a walkthrough of this game someone can look up? Stars Mary I mean, says, I, "Do your right." is quite tricky. Do you want me to look up a walkthrough for you? I can. Yeah, look up a walkthrough. See if it says anything about just this part. Watch, watch it be like survive. <laughs> I mean, there's like a button you can press, Control, Control F U or something. All right, one sec.
why 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 are they so freaking like tough? It's like they go through, they go like boo 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 boo, but I'm dead. Walkers just watch for patterns. Like even when I start off, I get nailed a bunch of times before I even get like a clear like anything. No patterns, by the way. It's just bullshit. There's no patterns. So as they go one way, so as they go a different way, there's no patterns here. All right. Well, I'm I'm keep, I'm still playing. Maybe like a game G or something like that. No, the only thing the walkthrough says is complete the jet ski se arcade sequence to arrive on the submarine. <laughs> There's no tips at all? Nope. And you know, this game doesn't have any hit book either. It's like, you can call the 900 number. Can you call the 900 number for me? Uh, what? No. Why not? I'm sure my friend. Look how, look how they all are in the front at the same time. I'm gonna, I'm gonna look at several hit books here. I'm how can I possibly avoid ones. them if they all come to the front at the same time? There's something I'm not doing right here. Does the walkthrough say you can only move left and right? It doesn't say shit to walk through. Arcade sequence hint. Watch carefully for patterns. <laughs> Like I'm, I'm dying. Like does the space bar do anything? Like, I don't. I don't think so. It makes me lean to the right. That's yeah, happening by itself. Space bar makes me go to where the mouse. Space bar is like the pointer. It makes me go to where the mouse is. Everything is controlled by the mouse, basically. You know what this game is missing? Uh, in in classic Lucas Arts games, there was uh, there was the option to skip arcade sequences. Cheated. <laughs> hey, my happy sunrise. Oh, James, come over and see me with your fish playing with your documents. Oh, my. Is it the game? How did your trip go, James? What about the submarine? With the stealth bomb. Shot. The weather temperature was ideal. Very well, let me give you an overview of the situation. A secret organization known as Spider has the airplane. They are asking for a ransom of 1,000 pounds of plutonium to be assembled within the next 24 hours. Otherwise, the stealth will make nuclear attacks on the world's main capital. Washington, Moscow, Tokyo, London, Paris, and more. Obviously, the government is taking this affair very seriously. So, basically, if we don't give them plutonium, then they'll, they'll launch nuclear attacks? That sounds Precisely. a little off to me, doesn't it? Yeah, just a bit. <laughs> 1,000 pounds of plutonium, that's astronomical. Yes, it would be impossible to gather, and no way we would give that much fissionable material to a terrorist group. Spider must be stopped, James. Who's, who's saying this? Why is it, why is it a different color? I don't know. 
I think it's I think it's still him. Same guy. Yeah. Spider must be stopped, James. Find the airplane and destroy it. Where's the cold spider? Do we have any more information? Yes. Our suspicions were well founded. The documents confirm that the plane has landed in Santa Paraguay. That's where we started the game. Yeah, I know. This is <laughs> brilliant. They also tell the exact position. Only? Who said only? James. I don't know, why do you say only? Well, well, after we looked into it... <laughs> he was saying only because they only... They only tell well, it's an also. Position. It's an also. Well, after we looked into it, the information tells us that the runway is located 300 feet under sea level. So say, say that. I don't know. How do I say that? I don't know. If you're the voice actor, figure it out. Gasp. <laughs> that was lame. We should be there in a few minutes. Good luck, James. Thank you, Sha. I'll do my best. And maybe screw a little women on the way. <laughs> Who's this guy? James, good to see you. I guess we'll see you. This bald guy with glasses. Oh. <laughs> I thought that okay. Hi. I, um, hi, Q. Your wish list from Santa Claus is Put ready. Wait, 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 wait. Compact disc. Do be careful. Oh, I was going to forget a cigarette case and a wetsuit. What? Now for some technical details. The stealth is impossible to detect, completely invisible to radar, and electronic surveillance. Thanks to an extremely new advanced camouflage system. So electronic surveillance. That's surveillance. You read that wrong. Electronic surveillance. Okay. <laughs> Smart ass. The principle is easy to understand. What about the teachers? Are they also easy to understand? Where's the principle? <laughs> Every wave, sonic or optical, that reflects on the aircraft is analyzed. And the reflection angle is cal recalculated and returned so that it appears that no object is in the way of the wave. Thanks for the science lesson. It was a shit. Of course, the sheer quantity of calculations are astounding, and the computers that make them are too big to fit into the aircraft. Skip the science lesson, Q. Give me something yeah. more useful. That is the stealth Achilles heel. James, destroy the brain and we'll take care of the aircraft. The compact disc contains a specialized computer virus that will erase all of the stealth programs from the brain computers. Okay, Q, thanks for the brilliant briefing. I feel like I've got an A+. What's, with, now. what's with the music in this game? I don't know. It's, it's so right. inappropriate. Every single music selection is inappropriate. <laughs> Always asleep. We need to screenshot. Oh, did they shoot at a torpedo tube? <laughs> Always asleep says, I think I hate this. Oh my god. It's really arcade sequence? Yes, you have to avoid all the sharks. Don't. Oh, wait, hold on. Let me do this one. I guess I might as well. Yeah, uh, what, what? just save it the same way. The game still sucks. More bullshit. <laughs> These, these sharks don't like go a thousand miles an hour. Jesus! I didn't even touch him. I didn't even touch him. You punch him one on his ugly. Skull. I didn't freaking touch him. You were in his way. <sighs> Why is he swimming uh, sharks? I think the um, it the. The detection. And why is it going up? Of, the detection in front of them is very sensitive. What are why is he going up? Now? Well, that shark doesn't hurt me. That one does. I, I don't understand. How come the same thing happened last time I was in the water? James Bond is always going up. 
no matter what I do. And what's with this freaking music? Da 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 da. Swimming. Da 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 da. I'll have you know, I can't ever swim. He's incapable of going down. In fact, I can't go up either now. His swimming ability is very limited. Hold Morse button down. What? Morse button, like Morse code. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, no. Oh, maybe. Maybe you have to hold the mouse button. I'm gonna see. It's like, I got part of the way through it, so I'm gonna see. It. It's like cowboy music. It always seems back to Game of the Year. Yahoo! Oh, Silver! Oh no. Oh well. <laughs> That's why I had an interim save there. Why would I punch a shark? That's how I that's had a death wish. Da, 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 da. It's not an adventure game, by the way. It pretends to be an adventure game, but it's more of an act. I guess James Bond, there should be some action. I, I, I can, like, understand that, but what they do it is so poor. This isn't really much action, though. This is just bad arcade sequence. Yeah, right. I have played so many good James Bond games. I have quite a lot of them, and um, this is definitely not one of them. Hi. Yo, I would, if you could shoot the sharks, it would be cool. One of my favorite Bond games was, uh... uh Go ahead. Um, Sorry. Bloodstone. James wow, Bond I Bloodstone. How did I miss that guy? Huh? Are you doing it in reverse now? What is going on? Well, this whole time... What's going on here? <laughs> oh, this is this. That's is like broken. Now that's a bond. Oh, in slime spot, you get to shoot spark. It's broken here. Jeez. I think the whole time I was supposed to go to the right, not just dodging. Oh, maybe, maybe, yeah. This reminds me of the Ace Ventura game where you had to do similar things. You had to dodge shit and always go to the right. Time to play through. <laughs> yeah, I didn't want to load that game. That was a. Um. <laughs> what was I saying before? Oh yeah, there have been James Bond movies where he's gone swimming with sharks, and he took like harpoon guns with him. He just go by himself. All right, I I'm assuming this one I gotta go is keep progressing to the right. A better game where you can shout at your computer you can scoot here and have to avoid sharks. <laughs> and then we have this upbeat music too. Is, this isn't the kind of music you'd want to uh, swim to sharks to? Oh, it was a bottle. Name a better game where you get shot out of a torpedo tube in scuba gear. And That's what I just read. <laughs> What's the bottle? 
Oh, I no, I remember reading this in the walker. You have to grab it. Yeah. Take, take James Max it. I want the freaking bottle. Take the bottle. God, why is it new flex player? What? What next player? What is this? A bottle thrown in the sea by strange people with a message inside. A great bottle, maybe? Try operate bottle. There you go. You take the message out of the bottle. You read... Demoralized programmers, wait your letters of encouragement. The entire team of Del... Oh, my God. No! The entire team of Delphine wishes you an enjoyable time with James Bond. I, I think you're like going to kill these people. Like, I, I wish, I wish like, right now, one of these programmers is right here. I, like, freaking knock his brains out. Do you remember the one stream you had where you were, like, bitching about the game and Ap Apogee was in this? Yes. I'm sorry, that was so funny. <laughs> Tries to leave for the next player. This game sucks, and Apogee's like, uh, I'm here. Is he stuck now? Oh, I ran to a shark. Why couldn't I go to the right from there? This is a maze? I think this is a maze. I was supposed to go like up an hour, or I was supposed to go back to the left. I can't go down. Maybe go after the people who drop the uh, the bottle out of the boat and kill them. Maybe it's the team that dealt. <laughs> James Bond's secret mission. You can't go up. Software. Go back to the left. What in the world is going on here? I don't know. Maybe you had to go to the left all the time. They're from France. They're, they're not from Quebec. They're from France. I don't even think they exist anymore anyway. They they uh they went out of business a long time ago. I wonder They're from why. France. They're definitely from France. Yeah, they went out of business a long time ago. A friend of mine, I think, used to work there. Oh, maybe you can kill him. <laughs> he's, he's, he's actually he's a nice guy. Shoot East Ford. Has, that's what I did, Matthew. And I got to the bottle. Then what? They were France. They never surrender. Get what, Matthew? Just like a bone. The shark is angry and wants to do right to the main. Wants to go right to the main fish. You, bravo, died once again. <laughs> Why have we sunrise says the music is definitely loosening my pals? <laughs> Toilet music. <laughs> oh my god. Let's go down? Yeah. I'll try down too. I tried out but it didn't work. It's very hard to go I'll down, by the way. You can't I actually go you down. down. I bet you down doesn't take you anywhere. Ah, uh, down does. Aha. Uh -huh. What's this? Really? Uh, sir, <laughs> sir's banking. I worked on this game. I wrote this kick-ass music. Tell me this music doesn't scream James Bond. I swear. I dare you. Definitely Are those like dancing to the music? Uh, I can't go this way, it's like bouncing me off. I the... think you'd have to go the other way. Probably right, but I want to try first. Hey, entrance. This is entrance, so that... <laughs> Examine. Entrance. Uh, Matthew, I thought you never got to this part. He's looking at a walkthrough now. Oh. Is there a screen A to be in first? Well, do tell. 
Yeah. This is where you end up after this. This is like I'm being pushed out. Isn't it? I know. I'm going to choose from the bottom of the ocean. Because <laughs> all these guys are like saying the same thing. <laughs> And the trees look like they're dancing to the to the music too. I'll be honest, I, I seem to think that uh, maybe everybody who made this game was sniffing blue or something at the time this game was being designed. So probably... What's your what's your idea for uh, stuff for the bottom of the ocean? Oh, I think uh, some palm trees. Some palm trees. Nobody seen it before. Maybe have them at the uh, bottom of the ocean. Let's go this way. Yeah, I'm going west. This is the sharks of this part, it looks like. It's stupid because it says an entrance. Do, 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 do. It really sounds like cowboy music, though. What? Is it special? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I can just drink right now, actually. What's this? There's <laughs> shit over the floor here. Would you like a martini shaken, not stirred? Vodka martini, please. Yeah. Shake it, not stirred. Vodka martini. He's swimming through the wind above water. Yeah, baby. I love how the sharks don't even affect you now. Those, no, those are the, the small sharks that were dead. Only the big sharks. I can't. I can't. All right, I can't go to the this tentacle no i think it's just seaweed seaweed oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The tentacle. take it oh shit so that one of those big sharks Music is still so much better than previous stuff, yeah. Yeah, but, there, none, but none of the music in this suits the game, though. Like, it suits the scene, anyway. It's all it's all out of place. Take seaweed, no need. Come on, you stupid fool. Oh, God. Of course, on this screen, this, this asshole. Not the seaweed? Matthew, I don't need the seaweed? <laughs> Look how it ends abruptly all of a sudden. That's gonna start again. Back to the endless loop of music. I'll go one more to the left. If I can. I don't think I can. I think next week when Stars Manny goes jogging, we'll find wow, out how that, that guy missed me. That he has become a serial killer. What is it, Matthew? Is that leaping thing? This? Seaweed shark. Left seaweed. It makes a difference which one? Now how the hell would you know this without a walkthrough? Oh, this guy's about to get me. I, uh... At last, my shark ship got you double ocean. Matthew, it matters which seaweed to get? Oh, jeez.
He said, examine left seaweed. It came and go sometimes. So as you can, so as you can't. It's like if they're in the mood to let you go, you can go. If not, you can't go. It's it's one of those things. Uh, Police Quest 2 suffered from this. You have to click on a certain spot. To oh my the god, the interface of Police Quest 2 is a bazillion times better than this. I'm not saying it's not. I'm saying in Police Quest 2, there are certain screens where you it's have to click on... The same thing very tasty. Oh, bottom of the patch? Nothing here. Fish? There's I fish think there. I think it's one more screen over, Stu. No, I saw fish. Was that the same fish? Wait, if that's if that's if there's some fish supposed to get there in the seaweed, that's like the biggest pixel I've ever seen in a game. I just don't understand the entire point of this. Why are we grabbing a fish if that's what we're grabbing? I, I don't know why we why are we even doing why are we here? Why are we streaming this fucking game? <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> why? Why is my life it's just generated to this? Why did my voice not come back? Why am I stuck here again? Why is this game so arbitrary? Yeah, right. Why the specific seaweed and not another one? It's just, it's just really all of this is just dumb. And the fact that nobody would know this unless they had a walkthrough in front of them. I saw the fish at one point. They asked the fish a sweet water. Yeah, I think so. Go to, go to the next. Um... They asked the programmers. <laughs> Fair game. We've got to examine random sea while sharks are after you don't receive. <laughs> what happened? 007, I want you to go to the bottom of the lake. I've got sure. multiple sharks and poke around in seaweed until you find a little minnow and bring it back to base and I'm going to have it for my dinner. Is this street yeah. up in Middle World War or something? No, that's, yeah, that's what we're thinking, Matt, Matt and I. Is just go, okay, so go to this screen, past this screen. I don't know if I can. You probably can, it's just that, you know, they have to click the specific spot. Oh, I'm gonna pull up one of the walkthroughs that I looked at and see if I can... Uh... Oh, I can't go to... Wait, I... Oh, no. I stuck my head in, but I can't actually go. Hang on. That means I can't go to the left from here. I think this is far left as I go. So there's an elastic band in the left seaweed. Elastic band? Elastic band, yeah. How do I get it? By operating the seaweed? It says examine seaweed, the one on the far left. You must find the elastic band. Swim right until you can no longer continue right. Then examine the palm tree. And there's a button in the palm tree that opens a, a, a hole in the cliff. Oh my god, this is fucking... This is something, man. This is, uh... Oh, bro. This is crazy. This is crazy. Crazy! What's that? Okay, hold on. Don't don't look at the left seaweed for a second. What's that left shiny? Said, what's that? What's here? What's that? That right there? Yeah. I know. It looks like it looks like a like a like a ring, but I can't examine it. Did it say about gleam of the seaweed? Where it did? No, I, nobody said you were crazy, Matt. We just. The walkthrough, you, you weren't telling us what, what to grab specifically. You just said examine the left seaweed. Maybe, now maybe we know na now we know what we're looking for, at least. A no, needle in a haystack. very tasty over here. The 
you'll be pleased to know that we're not too far off from the ending of the game. Thank God. Yeah. It's like, it must be a great game, because like, I'm, at, I'm at the point where I'm like, please let this be over. Wow, I don't have missed that guy kind of missed me. So hard to control this go. No. There's only three more scenes. Oh my god! Why don't I punch the freaking shark? Maybe don't punch the shark and leave me the freak alone. Do we even know which freaking patch of seaweed it is? Examine Jeeves. Who examined Jeeves? I don't think it's that one. I, I literally think ah! it's that one. Alright, hold on a second. I need to... I need to get a drink, okay? I need to get, like, a, like some alcohol. I'll be right back. <laughs> Seriously. Hold on a second. <laughs> I seriously hope he comes back with a martini, shaken, not stirred. Yeah, that's, yeah. The only way to fight a James Bond game is a martini, shaken, not stirred. <laughs> you guys like, I bet he doesn't come back. <laughs> I should have come back. I'm like crazy. What happened? Fucking shit. This thing doesn't come back. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Oh, that's funny. Man, always asleep is the best. Always be <laughs> the best. Very funny. <laughs> Fuck this. I'm done for the night. <laughs> Here. <laughs> you can't even do anything because like you're just floating up, the controls are terrible, and there's a shark by your ass. <laughs> I still think it's the one on the top, the one with that that little thing that looks like a rubber. Right here. Yeah. Um. I did try to examine it a bunch of times. Okay, I don't see where the hot spot is. See me. So what, what about the- Oh! Ah! Yes! Ah, you see? We need a rubber- Because we changed spot, our gadgets are enough. We need a rubber band. You pick it up and place it in your box. Now get the fuck out of there. Go to the far right until you get to the palm tree. Save. Yeah, I saved. <laughs> So it wasn't the far left, it was the, the top one. Yeah, look what he just said. Oh well, shit, it wasn't far left. Thanks, Matthew. <laughs> well, it's, I mean, it's not his fault. It's the locker he looked at. <laughs> oh no! Whoa! Wow, I, that's why I missed that guy. I think there's no more sharks after this, this screen here. This song was number one on the only free source music site in 1988. The web devs tried to sue Delphin Software International in 1991. What? Is that true? It's your spank comes from the welcome. Is that true or some bullshit you just made up? It's hard to, it's hard to say with him. It's <laughs> pretty cool, though. I mean, I would have sued uh, There was no Delphin's free music site in 1988. There was no internet for kid like he, That's just horseshit. That's that's a that's a that's good. Really, uh, what, what, what the hell am I thinking? Yeah, no. It's a good prank <laughs> though, but uh, I don't I don't buy that one. I don't think MP3s even exist in 1988. Yeah, hundred percent made up. So. Yeah. All right, now can still I go pretty, in? Still pretty creative for a for a made up. Uh, yeah, it was pretty creative. I agree. 
No, so you need to examine the palm tree. But that's what I was gonna say, don't tell me. I was gonna say, do I have to put the, the elastic on the palm tree? I'll like no. snap myself into the entrance or some stupid thing like that. This isn't Austin Powers. <laughs> this is Austin Powers. <laughs> this is Austin Powers. This sure as hell is. Well, I examined the tree. I did that before. What did it say? There's a carving of the trunk. There's a button in the trunk of There's the trunk. There's an opening tree. in the trunk. Are you kidding me? Doors. Nothing to say no, about no. it. Have to, to, you have to push it. I'd rather use it on the palm tree. So I didn't have to leave the, leave the elastic band, really. I didn't, <laughs> the last, I didn't really need the, the elastic tree. band. I just, the I just need that for tree. later or something. The palm tree trunk is too hot, is too low. But it's so funny because he just randomly swims up. I know, it's what I understand. Like, I guess it makes sense. Like, I also bob up, but, but like, it should be this hard to control. Speak. No. No, I don't think. It doesn't seem far away at all right now. Unless it's the second palm tree. No, that wouldn't make it. This is like Adventures in Tedium. That's what this should be called. James Bond 007, Adventures they, in Tedium. They play a game called Adventures in Delirium, remember? Oh yeah, they'd probably get sued. Yeah, <laughs> Adventures in Delirium. The violet pain goes across your arm, mobilize for a few seconds. That's a what? great, uh... Am I dead? I can't swim. What'd it say? What the hell even happened? The pain goes away, so I need to wear the, the armband or something, I guess. Somehow it'll ground me. I've never actually played any of the Austin Powers game. I know that they, they made like a Austin Powers You Don't Know Jack way back in the day. Why did the bug like go away? It had like Mike Myers and uh, Mike Myers. Austin Powers and he was my fuck. Why did the bug go away? Did it screw up? I still don't game. understand. I still don't understand how your arm got hurt. What even happened? Yeah, I, I, I think I got electrocuted, but I couldn't read it. By what? By something in the tree. At least I know what Bond game to uh, to to uh, recommend to my enemies. <laughs> it's because he's floating up the whole time that it seems far away, you know. I gotta do this again so I can read it. Maybe I'll save the game first. The pain goes away as the bunny can electricity the water. That's what it said. Oh, okay. Why did they go in the hole? So I didn't. I, I actually was okay, is what you're saying. I just. I should have just kept going. No, I don't. Where is the damn button? Yeah, that's the thing. Where's the button in, in the context of the tree? When they see the trunk. They do like the, the bottom of the trunk. That's all that I can think of. Swim all the way to the bottom. I'm trying. Oh, there we go. Oh yeah, no, I see the hole opening up now. You do? I don't see shit. Yep, it's right in front of you. Just uh, go, go, point your uh, mouse cursor right in front of you. Right there. Right up, over, over more to the right. Keep on going. There you go. I don't know. On my screen, it's very bright. He's still so. stuck, though. Oh, wow. 
Oh, you're right. Like, I see the other screen. It's The colors are completely different. Weird. I see it's so much darker on my screen. <laughs> Look what Sir Spankum said. Did you guys not watch the show? You can tell there is a button hidden in the tree because they made the color of this tree a point zero 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 one percent lighter shade of red. Classic underwater tree button hiding trick. Do you guys not watch the show? We don't. We don't watch the James Bond TV show. <laughs> yeah, is, is there a show? The the passage closes behind you and the water lowers. This must be a decompressor. You decide to get rid of your diving suit. Yeah, that seems like a brilliant idea. How are you going to get out of here? Is another cutscene? Yeah, I didn't get out of here. I guess who cares? We could commit suicide at the end of this. Yes, uh, you missed... Uh, James Bond just did a, a poem. An <laughs> uh, ode, ode to the shark. But it's a good way to save this game, too. This game is Francis Revenge of the English. Let's take a few moments to talk about the shark, you know, wonderful soliloquy. What can I do here? Examine. The shrinky molesting art. Porthole. Alright, let's see. Can I take the rock? Let's forget about it. He's walking so slowly. This game is France's revenge on the English-speaking world. Oops. Sounds about right. <laughs> Cake rock. Can I operate rock? No. All right. Examine the porthole. Porthole. You find nothing. Okay. Operate porthole. Sounds like a porthole, oh. by the way. Bond knows all about operating any kind of a hole. Oh, well. Wow. Yeah, very funny. You missed the tree molesting arc. <laughs> oh, he's going up the thing. So I guess that was not where Matthew got stuck. It must be right right here now. Oh, my God. Stormtroopers. Wait, is this... They're all, they're, all, they're all, like, waiting to come out of the hole. Look, they're like, oh, I can't even save here. They're, they're all, like, waiting for you to come out of that hole. Hello, what, Mr. Bond. What's with his hands? How have you what, been what's, enjoying... What's, wait, what's coming out of his hands? I don't know. Uh, All right, sorry. Uh, Wingardium, you're, you're Wingardium Leviosa. You... Hello, Mr. <laughs> Bond. How have you been enjoying our company up until now? Not very well. Yeah. <laughs> How have you been enjoying this game, I mean, honestly, like, right now, if I had to read this game right now, my opinion... So, my... you... I agree at first. <laughs> Just in case it scrolls off the screen. Oh, you are the in you are the famous Bond Otto has told me so much about you. <laughs> Let me introduce myself. I am Doctor I am Doctor Y, the absolute master of spider. So instead, my of organization, instead, instead of Doctor instead of Spectre, it's Spider, instead of Doctor No, it's Doctor Y. My organization is spread throughout the whole world. We are in total control of many criminal organizations and groups. He should be I, I, he should be I Asian, basically, theoretically. Um, so anyway, I was going to say, like, if I had to rate this game right now, like, just... I should... If, if they said, like, I should, you, you can't play the rest of the game, Stu, you have to, like, rate the game right now. I'm not joking, I would probably give it a 1 out of 10. Yeah. Because I am so annoyed at this game. There's, there's like, it could have been good. I should, I should read <laughs> his line as Don Adams. That would be even funnier. Yeah, Don Adams, you could do that. Yeah. Uh, well, I am done Don Adams and so on. Your government is quite naive to believing that they... Well, he's talking right now, by the way. So talk. <laughs> what? What? It's the same guy. Dr. Y. I don't understand why they keep on changing the fucking Your color. Your government is quite naive to believe that they or you will stop me, Mr. Bond. I control a weapon that will totally dominate any force. The ultimate instrument of destiny is in my power. I can't, I can't do the voice so well because my, my, th my throat is screwed up. But I'm just trying for the Don, Don, Don Adams, not Don Knotts. Thanks, Stuart. Let's the Don rampant, Nots. stupid vermin that infest this earth will really be good. exterminated. That's good. Now, now go for Don Knotts. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, now it's him again. Okay. Time is precious, so let us pay attention to you, my dear Mr. Bond. I think it's the same guy the whole time. 
Oh, it's Lord the Cage. My lovely piranhas are kept very hungry. Did you know, Mr. Bomb, that these little darlings are capable of devouring an entire man in less than a minute? Y you wouldn't want it to make my pretties wait any longer, would you? I, uh, this is... I still can't freaking say it. Uh, 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 look how slowly the cage goes down. Good. <laughs> this, this is like something from Austin Bowers. Well, that scene with the the scene with the freaking um, the roller. I gotta, you don't want to die. I did like no, but stab I mean, in the cage. If I could get my, there we go. So I do with Tweety unless it could sing us a song. Oh my god! There's a control panel. I need to like. Do I, what do I have in my inventory? Use. Oh, is it, must use the elastic band. Is that what, is that the deal here? Because if I am like this, then, then, then I hate this game. No, um, I no. Don't tell not, me. Don't cheat. You're looking, you're looking at the walkthrough. You can't cheat. Maybe the maybe the watch. No. I thought that was clever. Is there anything else here aside from the winch control? Why does the bad guy sound like Wallace Shawn? <laughs> yeah, no, I haven't done Don Adams in forever. That was so. Wallace Shawn. Oh, I doesn't do anything. Uh, operate, watch. Operate. Operate, pen. Use pen. Okay, which control? The pen, the pen shoots supposed to shoot rockets. Right? Oh, that's the cigarettes shoot rockets. Hold on a second. Let me go back and look at my at my notes here, or my uh, manual. Um, Wallace, Wallace Shawn is actually in the newest King's Quest, the uh, the one made by... Uh, the pen is supposed, the, to, is supposed to dissolve pen. metal. It's a cutting pen, supposedly. So why the hell can't I dissolve this with this stupid case? Um, this stupid is there a cage. lock on the cage? Is there a lock? I don't know. Uh, maybe I should use the cutting pen on the cage, though. Just, just accept your fate. <laughs> just accept your fate. <laughs> Are you still carrying the red carnation? Yeah, apparently. Uh, stop it, Matthew. <laughs> what do I have here? The watch cable. Uh, the pen. The recording razor. I have all this crap I don't need. Shave your face while you're waiting. What? Well, shave your face while you're shave waiting for face. your inevitable fate. Use the piranha remote. Oh, examine lock. There's a lock here. Stars Manny, I didn't realize this is with 60s Batman. The shark repellent bat spray. Use pen. Unlock. All right, I made a step towards freedom. Use watch on something I can use it on. Wall, door, winch control. No. Uh, also the cigarette case. Electric razor, electric cable. I don't know what this case is. The watch should be the... Sh oh, here, grill. No? That seemed, why the, that seemed good to me. The operate watch now? Use watch on wall. All right, get get out of there, bastard! What? D d d d exit! Oh, come on! <laughs> <laughs> this is so dumb. This, this guy's retarded. It's like Mr. Bean's version of Bond. 
he's gonna die because he can't. Now he's refusing to exit the cage. Did I, did I open the door? Not open the door. It, yeah, the door is open. Operate James. <laughs> nah, he's dead now. All right, I think I had the right idea. <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> All right, yum yum. What the hell is that? <laughs> Some kind of really ugly piranha. Oh, other side? Seriously? That's so dumb. Wait a second. If I was to do the other side, then, like, the fact that it let me do it on that side is really mean. Uh, use pen on block. No, Matt's saying do it on the left and right. Oh, okay. I guess to suspend the cage. I, so I would never have thought off. that my watch has two cables in it. You know, the biggest problem with this game is I, I feel like in order to understand half of everything, you have to keep on referring to the manual. Oh, seriously? Jeez. Welcome to the 007 Circus. <laughs> Let me just go through the grading now. Use pen on the grill? No. A trap like any other? It's not a trap. I can't go through the grill? Combine flower and rubber band, kill piranha with new weapon. Yeah, I, th how is it supposed to even know that there's a left, there's two ropes inside this stupid goddamn thing? That's not what it says in the instructions. In the instructions it says. Well, I guess it makes sense there has to be two parts to it. I try to operate. So what happens now that the thing went into the water? Nothing, I'm still alive. It'd be so funny if it says you died. I know, I wouldn't be surprised at all, actually. <laughs> do we have to do it from here? Oh, yeah, that's stupid. Brilliant. Brilliant. Oh no! Oh my god. Oh my god! Jesus sounds about right. <laughs> god! Those rats? The rats kill me? Probably. Oh no, it's the same goddamn thing. I can't get to a wrench. Except it's worse because you're in nighttime. Like giant rats? I need a drink. I'll be right back. What's going on here? What's the dead end? They can't get me. Man, this is where I lost my mind or played again. Hold on, hold on. That's a rat? That looks like a spider. <laughs> How is that a rat? It looks like a spider. Okay, I'm gonna revise my rating of this game. My new rating is zero out of ten. Do 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 the French know what rats are? <laughs> zero out of curious. ten. Because because honestly, that looked like a spider to me. That this might be like the worst game I've ever played in my life. Rats don't have eight legs, France. Okay, rats do not have eight legs, and they don't have freaking antenna either. This 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 really may be the worst game I've ever played in my life. Yeah, this. Delphin must have been high as shit when they made this. Yeah. 
That is the pick's pick of the what? The org taking over the world. There's only one good thing about this game. Only one. That... I don't know what the one good thing is. This game's total shit, I'm sorry. What is Roos? What do you want? This game has Roos? Roos? R-O-U-S's. Road into unusual size? I don't think they exist. I can't save it now? I can't save it. Okay. Organization. What is the? What about the R-O-U-S's? Uh... See, that's so cheap. The, 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 the programmers made this game suck. I should have to clip through the freaking thing like that. If I try to do something clever and oh, trap them, I should be able to trap them. Well, ho hold on, Matthew. You're trying to tell me that the organization Spider just has a giant ass spider that's trying to take over the world? Oh, that's, that's a symbol of the organization, they say. Oh. Oh, okay. I mean, it wouldn't surprise me if it, they did have a giant ass spider to take over the world, given all the shit we've seen so far. I really feel like this is like, yeah, I, I, I if I beat this game, I deserve like a freaking medal. I swear, this is why achievements were invented to make you, <laughs> to, to make you feel accomplished after you've beaten shit games. It might be. Holy shit. <laughs> I can't believe I'm still alive. <laughs> I'm playing some golden eye tomorrow to make up for what you've done to me. Yeah. I was actually playing some uh uh No dead James Bond everything or nothing today on uh PS2. Oh, that game was actually quite good. I, I will do it. I'm gonna do it. Just the question is like, how long will it take? Yeah. He'll finish it. The question is, will it be next century? <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, shoot, not the right way! Oh, what? <laughs> oh, man. How do you get to that thing? Pro tip, tip it's not like the spider saver of the world. It's, I, I can't even see the whole maze. You know what this sequence reminds me of is in Space Quest 2 where you're, where you got the glowing gem in your mouth and you're going through the underground caverns? Yeah. It's totally like that. It's, it's a little bit like that. Because I remember in Space Quest 2, there was a monster that tried to get you in the, in the underground cavern as well. So you had to, like, be very careful where you went and stuff. I knew that was a door. Oh, yeah, no. Space Quest 2, all, any Sierra game for me is amazing. I mean, they're, they're my number one favorite company. As far as I'm concerned, no other game company can come close to them. like a joke here. The world is not enough. Um, always asleep. The, the, um, everything or nothing, or no, sorry. Was it everything or nothing? Or... Yeah, I think everything or nothing is the sequel to yeah, The World is Not Enough. It's, yeah, I, I, it, it, I read that in the manual. So yeah, the world is not enough is the first game, and everything or nothing is the sequel to the world is not enough. Yeah, 
I, I like all uh, Sierra characters. I find that they're all really well written, and they always have a good backstory. Roger is pretty cool. I mean, Space Quest 3 was my first Sierra game. Yeah, 1 through 3 were fun. I was actually just in a, in a, a podcast the other day, and we were actually talking about this in the podcast. 4 was absolutely horrible. That was one of the most it's racist shit. games ever made. What a level. Another world of secrets like this? I don't recall that at all. This whole... This, the whole... Difficulty of the sequence is just that you can't see shit. The problem with 4 was uh, Daryl Gates um, had just come off of the Watts riots. Rodney King, Watts riots. The LA riots. And what? The LA, the LA riots, you yeah, like, yeah, the, the Watts riots. You yeah. called the Watts riots? Yeah. Um, he was the chief of police, and he was very racist back then, and he used Police Quest. He he hired uh, Tammy Dargan, who was uh, the producer for America's Most Wanted, the TV series. So both of them were both hired to work on... Both of them were hired to work on Police Quest 4. Now, she took most of the, of the, of the writing under her belt, but he was insistent on adding in all these black stereotype people for whatever freaking reason. And uh, I guess it was so that he would be like, oh, look, see, I'm not racist. There's black people in my game. But all of the black people in his game were stereotypes of black people, which made it even more racist. Because everybody talked like oh, Will man. Smith back back on uh, who, uh, back on uh, Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. Like the, the, the one guy who calls John Kerry is like, yo, yo, yo. Like, this is so bad. Yo, know, this is like rats in a maze. Johnny Bond. Yeah, Johnny Bond. Yeah, it 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 was the one with uh, uh blue. It was one of the ah! blue screen, but they digitized the actors. Shit. Um, the voice acting was terrible in it. It's I almost feel like half the voice actors were just Sierra programmers. You remember about that game? Like the very beginning, there was like a black character who's like, "I heard shots, good ah, shots, ah. pop, 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 pop." Yeah, yep. yep. <laughs> yeah, and then and then like and then like Herbie Lewis, <laughs> like the, the guy that you interview on the street. Right. What's your name, young man? Herbie Lewis. <laughs> Where do you live? I live with my grandma down on Hoover. Really. <laughs> Stupid. We need a song that sells the player sticking through air vents, death gravity core. Look, I wish they could do this, honestly. Trumps has it. I'm on it. The final thing that really pissed me off about Police Quest 4 is that he gets a Medal of Valor by literally burning the ending uh, serial killer alive with a freaking lighter and, and hairspray. And then the... the the, the chief of police, Daryl Gates, is like, Congratulations, Carrie, here, you won the Department of Valor, the Medal of Valor. It's like, no, con it's not how that works. <laughs> you know, the whole point of being a police officer is to prevent killing people, not to just go around lighting people on fire. This game is toy with me. I don't know where I'm going. That's not the right way. Oh, actually, I can make go around here. Oh, that flashing thing is the exit? Yes. Okay. For, the, for this level, anyway. I'll show you what it looks like. That would have been helpful earlier. What's this? Oh my god! <laughs> Are you kidding me? This is nuts. So now you're in some guy's bathroom. I think it's the same guy, Otto. Oh, was it Otto? It was a soldier. Let's talk to him. <laughs> my name is Bond. James Bond. That doesn't do anything. 
He's like, I don't care. I'm brushing my teeth. God damn it. Your discreet <laughs> entrance was perfect. The soldier attacks. With a, what, with what, a toothbrush? <laughs> okay, you go over to the soldier and punch him in the nose. Is this reasonable? What? <laughs> All right, I got it. I got him. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. There we go. Now grab his toothbrush. Actually, it's something useful. <sighs> He's lying on the floor without moving. Those long hours of training have taken their toll on him. I did something useful. I can't believe it. Take clothes. Can I sh like operate him into like the closet? I don't know. I'd say look around the room. Maybe grab his boots or something. I don't know. Well, yeah, but I, th I thought I could like operate him into the closet. Take. This isn't Hitman. Army boots. Well, it should be like. Take the boots one moment, please. I guess you... What? What? I gotta take a piss. What? <laughs> Hold this, on! What's this string Hold here? on! Is that with what? laces? Grabbing the boots lets you dress up like him? I guess. Look at those knots. Operate laces? Um, Take Matthew, places? Matthew, what you said earlier, it did then, LA was a different monster than thanks to Gates. Gates is actually the guy who founded SWAT. So after the Watts riots, he what, was the what, one what who happened? came up, he was the one who came oh, now up it's with the What? First of all, I, I didn't mean to leave. It just left by itself. How, how, do, they know know you're, <sighs> how do they know you're a spy? I don't know, I just don't think you're wrong. And what a free fishing excursion. I was about to say it reminds me of uh, Space Quest 1. You know? That, that reminds me exactly of Space Quest 1. The, the Sarian base. Yeah, right. Yeah, let's try it again. Doody doody do. I'm brushing <laughs> my teeth. <laughs> hey, like, what the heck? His mouth is like opening as an X at his eyes. Don't look at the chat, whatever you do. Tied gag him? Oh. So he's not just not to spoil, you just said. I was trying to operate him. I was like, I supposed to use the laces to, uh, to tie him up. Is that the idea? I wasn't even going to leave the room. Just maybe leave the room. Yeah, yeah. Gates, Gates. Uh, as a matter of fact, SWAT is so much better than Police Quest Four. SWAT was actually a training. It was. It was supposed to be. Everyone thought it sucked. Police Quest SWAT, the first one, the FMV one, because they thought that it was a game, but it wasn't. It was a um, simulator, training simulator. That's why I like Police Quest SWAT one is because if you go into it knowing it's a police training simulator, it's actually a really good game. Because they have a napkin. You probably use that as a gag. Yeah, I guess. It says, he won't bother you now. Good work. I guess they're lying. I thought, I, why can't I just beat the shit out of him? There you go. Now he's as quiet as a mouse. Well, why, why did I have to do that? Why can't I just beat the shit out of him? That's much more entertaining and enjoyable. Like, like if I beat the crap out of him, which I did... He's gonna wake up like in one second. Bot is like the biggest whip I've ever seen. Wow, I mean, does this does any of this feel like a Bond movie to you, though? Let's be honest. No. Exactly. This is like Bond if the people who made a Bond game have never read any Bond books or seen any <laughs> Bond movies in their life. A lot of the Bond it's books are pretty bad, so we did read the Bond books. But either way, this is like Bond if nobody did their research on Bond. Okay, good here. Now this reminds me of a little bit of Space Quest. You you don't get a gun in this game from what I'm, I've am been Soldier, seeing. your clothes... Are oh, you different supposed to read these? You're supposed to read the voices. Soldier, your clothes do not meet uniform standards. <laughs> your boots aren't tied. Oh, oh my god, seriously. But wait, it seems I've already met you, my soldier. Catch him! What? I guess you're not supposed to go this way. 
Okay. Your boots aren't tied. What is this? The secret I use, organization I use, I use my of mom? I, I use my 10 foot long laces to tie up this guy. Because you can really tie up a man with a pair of shoelaces. It's totally reasonable. On cast fist? Go, go, gadget fist! Alright, now what's here? Examine nothing. Door. Can I go with this one? No, I can. Ooh, look at this. Some stuff. It's a room. Gun, gun, wait. I saw gun keys. Gun keys. You do it, nothing happens? Oh my god. Give me a gun! Nothing's happening? Oh my god. Let's forget about it, yeah. Exactly. Freezer. This is nothing, apparently. Sacks of flour. Drawer. Fuse box. Okay. Operate. Well, always, well, always asleep, there's your answer. When do we get a gun? <laughs> Never. 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 <laughs> He's probably uh, going to take the sack of flour instead. <laughs> okay, it opens. It's in there. Oh, my God. Do I have to open every single one individually? Blank wooden stamps? Okay. Okay, I can't open that one. I could open this third one here. Alright, so I can only open the ones that are down here, apparently. Well, thank God for that. <laughs> yeah, I agree. This drawer is empty. What the hell was that? You saw that? Why did it say open it like that? Empty. The, the color was different that time. Full of laces. Ah, okay, good. Uh, take. So laces. now I can use the laces. So they only noticed that you were Bond <laughs> because you were not wearing uh, shoelaces. Apparently, let's see. Use laces on James. Lace your boots. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. At least this is a at least this is an adventure game again, sort of, right? Uh, well, not one that I'd ever play. Well, it's but, at least uh, it's an adventure game, not like a a rat in a maze game. Operate. No, I'm, I'm, I'm sure we'll have another one of those before the end of the game. Boss. A result. Okay, screw the fuse box. Why is Bond so fat too? Do you notice that? He's like so fat. <laughs> I think he's wearing like what like a you know, like a bulky costume. Hey, stop sure spankums. Oh, he's making stuff up, okay. Go east and salad with red doorway for a moment. And Carl come in my first name. <laughs> Employing I guess you mean orientation. That's really funny. Yeah. I thought he was I thought he was giving a spoiler. I can't go in this, this room, I guess. I don't think so. I to say about no. it, but you can't go in there. Do you, did you notice one thing? Um, it, you notice what when it's something you can't interact with? It the dialogue that comes up is stupid. Because in Sierra games, it literally tells you, you can't do that. Or you can't right. interact with that. This one, it just says stupid shit like, uh, try again later. Or, you know what I mean? Right. It, it's, just, it's just dumb. Okay, why can't they go up here? It's so hard to like, navigate the rooms. Oh, 
I still don't use that freaking elastic band, by the way. Give me a glass of water. Is he going to notice you? Oh, well, that worked. Well, where are you going to get a glass of fucking water? The bathroom. <laughs> the bathroom. The bathroom. The bathroom. Oh, the bathroom? Was there a I glass in there? So. No, but there's a sink in there. Water. Can they go here now? What is he, Italian? Uh, hey, give me I, a glass of water. I wasn't able to go in this room before. Now I can. The great dictator. <laughs> a wall of silence? Oh, stamp. <laughs> Is that a square not on your boots? He's a spy. Shoot him. What? What even? How what did, happened? He, how did he do that? He, op he opened a trap door by sticking his arms up in the air? I, I don't even... What did you do? Do I have the how box art at least make him look like Bond? Yeah, I, I mean, uh, the box art just shows like a shadow of him. I have the box here, but I don't know where it is. But I showed it the other day. Okay, what, what did you do? To, in your boots? <laughs> what did you do to make him open that? I took this. I tried to take the stamp. Is it frozen now? God damn, they're protective of their stamps. Holy shit! Yeah, I don't even know what the stamp was. Well, you already grabbed a stamp from the the drawer, though. I think I had a blank stamp. I probably had to switch them or something. You need to distract him first, wouldn't you? You would think so, but I, I, I don't even know what the hell it's, that stamp of it was. Examined officer. What else is here? Video drawer. Can I operate these drawers? Is there a remote remote control? Maybe we can port, turn on some porn for him. <laughs> Like be, be like Leisure Suit Larry, the, with the pimp. Use blank stamp with stamp. What is happening? Operate stamp. All right. I'm going to come back here later. <laughs> Let's see if I can find some water. Is he walking even slower now? I think he's actually walking faster. No, it's it's good nobody's going to the bathroom. Like my idea of stuffing him in the stall was way better than what the stupid thing they came up with. Like you stuff him in the stall and close the door, nobody's ever going to go in there again. No, oh, come okay. Where's the glass? It's like so hard because you can't see it. So like, there it is. Then fill it with water. Can you go into the toilet stall and fill it with toilet water? <laughs> <laughs> Just give it to the boss. Can you piss in the glass and give it to the guy. The with... It's <laughs> apple juice. <laughs> Here you go, sir. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> I didn't even realize we we had apple juice on the sub. Whatever we are on. If I like, if I was, if I'll tell you something. If I was playing this game without Matthew, and I find out like in five minutes I need the freaking elastic band and I don't have it, I would like be so angry. All right, so now this guy's left. Can I go in here? No, I can't. What is this? A cage? I shall name him Johnny. He looks like he's dumb in a suit. <laughs> Oh, come on, you can't go this way? Oh, you can't, all right. Now so what happened to that guard? Oh, so that guard asked you for a glass of water, and then he left? He le well, I guess they want you to get some water. It doesn't matter what you do with, you know... Glass no, I got the glass. What the hell is this? No, he, he already filled the glass of water, Matthew. Pay attention! <laughs> what? Is that my clothes? I don't know. I'm confused. 
Okay. Okay. You read mission order priority max My God! seven four three. Mission: Buy all the fantastic games of Delphin Software. Well, we're already done. Can we? There are no fantastic games, so we're, we, we're good. Can we seriously punch everybody who has ever worked for Delphin Software in the throat? <laughs> Oh my god. This is not even this is not even product placement. This is sheer cringe at this point. Oh fountain. I mean, is a fountain too? I I would grab the paper from the printer. Maybe I should have used the glass of the the water fountain instead of it instead of it here. Water is water, isn't it? I mean, the, I'm sure the water found water is probably better. I mean, I can't. Oh, there is. Wait a second. Buy Shaq Fu. Shaq Fu by Delphine Software. I see, would be surprised. See, Sierra did the same thing. In, in Leisure Suit Larry 1, when you in the original game, the, the, the parser interface, when you opened up Larry's wallet and you searched through the wallet, there's actually a, a Sierra business card in the wallet that says, hey, buy Sierra games. But they didn't make it as open and in your face as this, where they like make it like it looks like an actual object that you need. And then when you click on it, it's like, oh, by the way. I took the mission instruction now. I still have it. What? 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 Why would you? Okay, I don't know. What do you even need that for? Is, is this? Is there, okay, I don't know. What I'm doing it here. Let me let me leave this room. Let's call it more bullshit. Always asleep. I I'm beginning to wonder if you watch the same games as we're watching, or if you're on another on another stream and commenting <laughs> on ours. I think you're joking around. <laughs> no, I know. <laughs> <laughs> He's watching something else entirely and just chatting in our stream. Can I go left here? <laughs> I can. Oh, so that's where that goes. Can I go here now? Which I could have before. No, it doesn't look like that's openable. I bet you it is. I'm just not pressing it right. I got the guy some glass of good water now. But he's not there anymore, of course. Maybe he's behind that door. The store? No, no, the the one in front of you. This is where that guy was, the um Oh, I can't get in here. Where no, is... there's a panel beside it. Oh yeah. You're cheating. No, I just I can see it. Wait a minute. Hold on. Should and I no, I'm not cheating. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not even should looking. I, should at I, that. I try to cut the finger off of that other guy. No. What I'm thinking is uh, that that ink thing that you picked up. I picked, I picked up a pad. Ink pad. It was. I a, don't know. No, it was knowing an ink pad. this game's. It was a blank. This... A blank stamp. Oh. Uh, okay. It wasn't an ink pad. Oh, but I do have a. Th I do have a device. I forgot. I have a device. The cigarette case. Operate. Cigarette case. I have four cigarettes here. Uh, examine cigarette. This one has a blue ring around it. So some of the cigarettes are rockets, and some of them are. Um, which one is which? Yeah, the blue ring around it is the this is the um, is the fingerprint revealing one. All you do is place the microfilm on the spot that is fa you found the fingerprint. They actually actually put it on the panel. What do you think? I think I think you have to use it on something that there's a fingerprint on first. So that's well, why I'm thinking maybe go back to that bathroom where the guy was brushing his teeth. 
I could do I could try that too, but theoretically, wouldn't there be a fingerprint actually on the panel? Uh, could be, yeah. I, I mean, I, I don't see why not. If like if I like blow on the panel or something. So I press the wrong thing. I mean, if this works, it would be like a miracle, but like theoretically, I should like blow on the panel. Use cigarette on fingerprint ID. It's like you did nothing. Uh, let's see, what else do I have? Use. Oh, I, if I give the guy the glass of water. Maybe I blew it because I wasn't there at the right time. So I gave the guy the glass of water, and I got and then I got the, he drank and gave me the glass back or something. Then I'd have his fingerprint. You know. Hello. Yeah, I, I'm here. I, th I thought you said I fell asleep or something. No. No, God no! I don't. I don't go to bed this early. Jesus. Maybe I need to like restore the game and like get that glass of water and. Uh, I bet you I do. <laughs> I can't do cutting off the finger better. But that guy in the bathroom is a lowly, lowly right guy. Uh, oh, okay, 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 uh, okay. All right, I know. Am I wrong? I, I, yeah. Uh, so, I, I mean, I can tell you, or you can figure it out for yourself. Is that so I don't, I don't have to go back? No, no, you don't have to do anything. You're fine. You're fine. Uh, you don't have to go back anywhere. I thought I, I thought that made a lot of sense, honestly. Is so, what you said about going to the bathroom? Do you, do you, yeah, I was wrong, too. That's It's nothing to do with that, either. Okay, so maybe it's back in the room with the with the with the clothes or whatever, or we can just get it off the so guy. Go into that room right there. This one. Yeah. So, this is how stupid this game is. So this guy was the guy who asked for the glass of water. It is. But you're you, yes, but you you wouldn't have known that. I but didn't. It's, it's, I I looked at the walkthrough. Exactly. But, almost nothing interesting. Yeah, exactly. So you have to give him the glass of water. Now, take the... Well, he's... Yeah. Oh. You were supposed... Yeah, you were supposed to take the sample he but, bent over. But... 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 <laughs> um, I didn't even choose to do anything, first of all, but, like... Where was I at? More bullshit. How, but I don't know if it's the same guy. Looks like they like him. I I stopped questioning the logic of this game centuries ago. This is it's this just, is this is definitely um, possibly the worst game I've ever played. Yeah. This makes Shibuya Scramble an A plus in my books. <laughs> <laughs> Why is my voice so 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 shot? I feel I, I guess I can rest it a little bit. Use full glass with officer. Take. Okay, you place the one stamp you just took with a blank one. <sighs> Did I have a stamp? Examine stamp. Nothing to say about it. Of course not. Well, that didn't help me, did it? Okay, so. So now I'm supposed to use the, the fingerprint thing on the stamp? I can't do that. No. So uh, go to your inventory? Yeah. Uh, um. Okay, go back up. I, he's supposed to give you the... Yeah, he did give you the... the oh, the, he did the, give me the glass. Yeah, you use it on the glass. Because he would have touched the glass. I didn't even do that. Okay, use cigarette on glass. That didn't work.
You stopped what 30 years ago? Giving a shit about the game? <laughs> it's like you did nothing. It didn't work. Okay, it's you know what? I'm going to have to help you with this. I'm sorry, because this is a half-assed way of doing this. Okay, so you operate the cigarette case, examine all cigarettes, cigarettes, then operate the blue ring cigarette. So you operate? Have to operate, operate the blue ring cigarette first. And then use the cigarette paper on the glass. <sighs> Are you kidding me? Yeah. Oh my god. Isn't it fucking retarded? This is a so game that needs... This is a game that needs a walkthrough. I'm sorry. Because nobody's going to know this. this the not even reading Not this, even reading the manual would help you here. I did. Re and I read the manual. Yeah, exactly. Okay. I have a print now. I mean, I, I knew what to do. I just couldn't... I didn't know that was the same guy. Yeah, right? Man, we, and I know it's the same guy that I couldn't figure out how to make it work. Like... I got a cigarette here. Like, what do I do with it? Shove it up my ass? Stick it in my ear? I don't know. Miami Sunrise said, I totally think about that, Stu. Wow, with this game. There is barely any logic in this whatsoever. And it's and, and it's not just that, but, like, I mean, it yeah, it expects you to know all this stuff. And like, I still think it's good. I can walk in this door, and then those Trogdor guys are going to bite my balls off. What the the point? I sound like I'm like 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 I'm high pitched because I lose my voice. Oh my god! <laughs> Perfectly designed, ten out of ten. You've become you know the you've become you know they like the ETs like the worst game or Pac Man for the Atari Twenty Six Hundred. This is the worst game ever. Oh, hold on, sure. hold on. But E.T.'s not even playable. Oh, yes, you cannot is. say. Oh, barely. It's more you playable than this that. shit. Also, what is that picture of that woman? Yeah, That's kind of creepy. It's a skeleton, I think, right? Yeah. We also, did not, we, also did not keep, we also did not stop there. I don't know. How about if did you get Lifeboat? Yeah, the Lifeboat was back in the, uh, um, the, the room with the water fountain. <laughs> Where? The, the fountain that you got the glass water from. You you could probably go back. You don't have to restore, I don't think. You probably just go back out the door. Bulletproof window. What is this? This looks like a not, not good place to go. The rays are gleaming look very deadly. Jump into them. Let's see what happens. <laughs> What's this over I'm... here? Nothing. Ventilation hole. There's no, we didn't. Yeah, right there. Or, we didn't get. We, we definitely didn't get the lifeboat. Really? You're gonna go? Okay. You want to see what happened? <laughs> I was joking, uh, but that's cool. <laughs> There you are, transformed into a vulgar heap on the floor. Your adventure is over. Too bad for you. Yeah, my, uh, my life is over too. Uh, Roger, Roger, can you clean? There's there's ashes on the ground. Can you? Thanks, Roger. What was I up to? Oh, worst game ever. That's right. <laughs> Reminds me of comic book store guy. Worst game ever. I really feel like pouring this alcohol on my head and lighting <laughs> myself on fire. <sighs> like to make this end. Yeah. This is so bad. We're almost near the end. You know what so I can't believe? Keep, keep I've owned this game for like 20 years and I never played it. I never knew how bad it was. Like, I can't believe I never knew. How, I, I've owned this game for 20 freaking years. And I always thought like, Someday I'll play this game, and it'll be good, and I'll have a good time, and I'll be happy. And I didn't realize it was such a pile of shit. My God. You, you and Angry Video Game Nerd are identical, because almost all the games you play either frustrate you or piss you off. 
I didn't know it was be this bad. You guys need to have a joint collaboration at some point. I might even arrange it for you. Yeah, sure. <laughs> just, just you and James Rolf, just fucking trashing games. Okay, what am I doing? Can I just like do this anything with the CD? Like, where am I stuck? Put the CD. Is it like goes in a control board somewhere? Like, it's ass crack. <laughs> Where's a garbage dump? What is with that paper, right? See, that looks like it's something yeah. you can grab. Can you what not grab this? it? Oh, that's a fountain. That's right. Yeah. Is what's in that? Wait, what's someone's... in that? So there's a... What's in what? What's this in that door? door? This is where I came in. Okay. Then is there a door down at the bottom? <sighs> if there is, I would know where to know that. All right, one sec. Because <laughs> I know it's supposed to be in this room. The lifeboat, I mean. Like, I don't see a freaking lifeboat. Oh my god! Okay, so that door is not is is a uh, is a garbage chute. What? That door. There's like a switch over there or something by that door. This is the door I came in. No, no, no. Is what? it? I don't know. They they said something about this is a garbage chute. Oper yeah, operate garbage chute. Yeah, that's what. That's, that's the door I in. So there's got to be a, something in there that al that allows a garbage chute to open. Oh, Matthew says operate garbage. Well, there was garbage over here. Remember, I saw garbage dump. That's what you have to do. Operate garbage dump. Yeah. This game was a garbage dump. This game was freaking garbage. <laughs> You open the garbage and see. You open the garbage and see all of the Delphin software. No, this 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 game this game like the code for this game is a garbage dump of all like the like bullshit that the the coders, the programmers, the artists decide to like drop on an unsuspecting world. Seriously, what the hell kind of crap is this? Why why is there an inflatable life raft in the garbage? I, I don't even know what the hell just happened here. Why is the garbage up <laughs> not even on the freaking screen? Why not? If you think you'll go to the beach this afternoon. Sir <laughs> oh Spangard <my God. laughs> says, <laughs> use James Bond to stall the fair. DOS 1990 on garbage. Yeah, that's a great idea. Oh, that's brilliant. I like that. I wish I had it here. I wish I knew, I wish I knew where, like, where like my physical copy was. God damn it. Well, you can always sell it to somebody and you know, you know what? I'm gonna really I'm gonna thing. I'm gonna I'm gonna write a note to Brian Fargo after this, and I'm not joking. Brian Fargo is active on Twitter. I'm gonna write Brian What the fuck were you thinking? I finally played this game after twenty years of owning it, and it came out like thirty years ago. And it's like the worst freaking game I've ever played in my life. Um. Wait, what? What are you saying? Wait. There's something else there. What? Oh, oh God, damn it! There's something else there? What are the garbage dump? <laughs> no, there isn't. You already took the mission instructions, dude. Trust me, I'm looking at the same walkthrough you are probably. What? What else is there? My sanity. There, th there isn't. Keep going, Sue. Room with dump. You Must take a dump in the room. You're good. Oh, the, no, he's on the chair. So he's on the chair. Yes, that 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 was the card thing. That have you not been watching the stream, Matthew? Oh, you already got the thing from the chair. It was that that uh, mission document. I, I bet you I know what the, what the development process for this game of Miami Sunrise. Bunch of French guys were like, "Ha oh, ha ha! Maybe we have the the, 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 the player." Then I got into this dead end situation with a bunch of rats. Oh, it's so very funny, isn't it? Is it ink, ink pad? pad? Uh, I don't think that's in this room. He says it is. I looked at the chair, and it says, nothing to say about it. I tried to operate the chair, and it said nothing's happening. Is it because I wasn't standing next to it? No. Hmm. 
No result. I'd love to know what the arm of chair? process of this game was like. I bet if we found the programmers that they have a wallop of a story. Well, uh, we wanted to uh, make some extra Wait. money. An arm of uh, chair? So we release a Bond uh, game. But uh, joke on them, the How American, you... because... Wait, he's got the arm the... of the chair. How do I... Where's the arm of the chair? Are you trolling me, Matthew? I don't think it's in this room. Here, hang on. Let me look at uh, my screen for a sec. Use James Bond's ass on chair. Can I do that? I can't drive to anything here. So there's a chair. Oh, not this chair, the control room chair? Okay, so he's lied to me. Maybe wrong room. Alright, so it's not this room. Yeah, it's it's the room where the uh the guy was with the drink. Oh, that, now he's not there anymore or something? Like what is James Bond doing? This 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 yeah, really I, would be I the worst. Sworn, I could have sworn that this was a very important mission and of the utmost priority, and here <laughs> we are just wandering around looking for ink. <laughs> this chair here? Where this guy sitting here? No chair here. Wait, is this ink here? In the wrong room, I don't think so. Was there any other room that with ch with a chair? See, the problem with the walkthrough I'm looking at is it says room uh room seven. <laughs> it doesn't tell you what room seven is. What about here? I can't go there. Was he able to go here before? Oh, Matt, no, uh, no, M Matthew, you, you, okay, yeah, okay, go back to the, 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 the room that Matt was talking about the first time. So, you don't actually pick up the ink pad. This is the stupid thing. You don't pick up the ink pad. I didn't even uh, see an ink pad. So, you need to, uh, uh, click the stamp around until he dabs it on some random ass ink pad in that room. But there's no ink pad. Yeah, I don't know. But that's what I'm reading. <laughs> you don't actually take the ink pad, though. You just... You know, I can't take it. Where is it? Your guess is as good as mine at this point. Oh, wait! <clears throat> I didn't see it before. That was it, the right there. I know, I know, but what the hell? How are we supposed to know that's oh. an ink pad? Like that doesn't even look like, like an ink pad. I was able to take it. It's letting you take it? Yeah, I took it. Okay. So now use the stamp on the ink pad. Why? Why do you need a stamp? Why why do we need half the stuff we picked up in this game? <laughs> am I, am I just, uh, can you guys in the chat like please I feel like I'm losing my touch here. Do I suck at adventure games now? Is that what happened to me? No. Absolutely not. I play adventure games all the time. Are you sure? Have, like, maybe I maybe I need to like I have stop ton, playing adventure games. I have a ton of classic old games like these like this, and I couldn't even do this without a walkthrough. There is absolutely no logic behind any of this. 
the okay to make a good adventure game you have to be able to have the people know exactly what they're supposed to do right this game doesn't do that at any point <laughs> There is no point in the game where it directs you towards a specific goal or anything. It just kind of shoves you in every room and expects you to know what you're doing because you're Bond. James Bond? Yeah. I'm a card reader. Because you're 007. You're supposed to know what you're doing. There's a card reader here. What is it with that? Oh, that's a fuse box? Why is there a skull of a woman on it? There was a fuse box in the bathroom, too. There's a card where you're out of a card. I will vote for yes. You've lost your touch, not unlike your voice. Bam, roasted. All right. Always <laughs> asleep says I'm done. Folks, this could be the last stream that I ever do because I could never get worse in this game. Oh, my God. All this right. is why your next stream, you need to play the ones that I recommended to you. Because you know what? I think that puzzle one is going to be great for everybody because they'll be able to all interact with it. This one, we can't interact with it because the logic is just not there. So we have to resort to walkthroughs. Is this game almost over? Am I almost done? Let me check. I will check. Now do I just stick my dick in the, in the thing here? You have one more area. One more room or one more area? Area. <laughs> no! Thankfully, the ending area is just <laughs> one quick scene. What? So, one quick scene? Hmm? How much more is it going to be? I don't know what to do anymore. I don't, know where, about, I don't know where I am. I I'd say about another 20 minutes. So I'd say just keep going because uh, there's no point. There's not enough uh, to make it for another stream. There, there's no point because you're literally almost near the end. Can so I, I would shoot say a rocket just, at this or something? A gold ring around it. Let me use a rocket. So in the security room... If you want me to help you here, you're in this room right now. So you have to give you th this. You'll never figure this one out. So I'm just going to help you with this one. Yeah, there's so a mailbox. To, yeah, you need to. Wait, 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 wait. I'm looking at the mailbox. Yeah. That's so you need to put something in the mailbox. Yeah. You're never going to guess what it is, though. I just. <laughs> <laughs> the cigarette paper. Nope. The compact disc. Nope. No? Nope. The red carnation. The, the, the mission instructions. The one that says go buy <laughs> games from <laughs> Delphin Software. Really? <laughs> really? Yes. Wait, it's, that won't do anything. It says you're supposed to put that in there. And it distracts the guard, and then you go into the room. Maybe you have to first use the ink stamp on it. Hang on. <laughs> yes. Use ink pad on mission instructions, and then use the mission instructions on the mailbox. Why? Why? <laughs> so that he can mail it! So that he can get games! It never says to stamp it! It never says to stamp it! I'm here for the emotional breakdown. Offer the guard a smoke. He'll the lasers. That's a good idea. That's a good idea. And then the and then the smoke will be like a rocket. That'll be a good idea. That's how does it work? No. So you literally have to give him the game thing after you stamp it. You slide the mission order into the opening next to the bulletproof window. The guard makes a sign for you to pass. What? What? Why? You got him a bunch of free games from Delphin Software, so he's letting you through. Those games are all horseshit, though. He gets to play this shit game somewhere down the road. What the hell is going on here? It's like you're in the Twilight Zone. <laughs> <laughs> I really am losing my mind always asleep. This doesn't make any sense. And my voice is... 
Come in, Mr. Bond. We've been waiting for your arrival. If you knew I was here, why didn't you maybe sit through that torture? <laughs> why didn't you just bring me in the room? <laughs> for God's sake. <laughs> <laughs> Who's that fat guy? Uh, Doctor, Doctor Who. Doctor Who. Doctor, <laughs> Doctor Y, sorry. <laughs> Come in, Mr. Bond. Take off the uniform. It doesn't flatter you. Is he going to do like a strip tease now or something? Yeah. I still can't see the good thing here. That's a cutscene. The day has dawned, Mr. Bond. The world will finally know its master. Nothing can stop us now. Here we are at the dawn of the new world. Isn't it exciting, Mr. Bond? I was asphyxiated fix myself. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I really like him. I really don't think what, what James Rolf feels like sometimes right now. <laughs> okay. It's, yeah, yeah. Surface! I thought he disappeared in the chair for a second. <laughs> Surface. The world will soon see the light, Mr. Bond, and there is nothing they can do to stop me now. They'll soon discover that one doesn't play around with Dr. Y without dire consequences. But why? Oh, the music came back. Wow. Oh, there's some pictures, too, like some colors. <laughs> Thanks, always asleep. What's this? What the hell? Is that the sub? It's just, just, just. A, what's an that? island just came out of the. It's probably like an island with a sub. Oh, it. it's from Star Trek Three. It's the. <laughs> what? <laughs> the Genesis planet? Yeah. <laughs> what the hell is this? It looks like a cartoon now. Yeah. Is is uh, is the guy from Full Throttle gonna ride up on his bike? Yes. Like ben. 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 From Full Throttle. Yeah. What's that guy's name? Ben something. And throttle, believe it or not. And throttle? <laughs> yeah. Take off. Take off, take off, take off, take off, take off, take, take off. Where are we taking off to? Who's taking off? Who knows? Oh, that's the stealth jet. Bud's Aldrin. Max, I missed something. I, I missed everything. <laughs> you didn't miss anything. You see, Mr. Bond, when the electronic <laughs> up on the right reaches 346, uh, Washington will be no more. Ha, ha. What, wait, what did, I, what did I miss, 346. Matthew? Do you know how long that's going to take to reach 346? What is that, one? It's probably going to tick every five like, minutes. Brrr, ding, ding, yeah. Sorry, Bond, you suck, you loser. Why'd you want to play this game, you stupid piece of garbage? I think I've been, I think I missed the something. Visualization of the trajectory on the main board. What did I miss, Matthew? Look how fast it's ticking, actually. Why the number 346, Doctor? Why? Oh, Doctor Why. That's his name. Right. When I was a young child, my parents... Oh, do be quiet, Mr. Bond. Ooh. Right, Matthew says I missed something. I have to go back. Like, what? I, what did he miss? I don't know, but he I believe him. Room before that. You don't think I missed something? Okay. Use electric cable on electric plug. Make sure razor is on. Use a razor on trash can. What? What? How would you know that? How would you? Oh. What? I am so annoyed with this game right I'm now. I'm only back here. Wait, did I, did I have another like leader scene? So game? it's 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 right. Oh. At least you're near the end. That's what we can say. You're you're right near the end. <coughs> no, I guess it was after this. No, so it's after you. It's after you gave the um, 
the stamp to the or the, the the letter to the guy to let you into that room. Yeah, but what's so there is there is a hallway. Um, there is a hallway. Um, after you went through that room with the force field. Did I get the ink plat here? Yeah, I have the ink. Okay. So use. Uh, stamp on ink pad. Use ink stamp. Mission instruction. Use alcohol on brain. That you, poor guard is going to get a copy of this game somewhere down the road. On gun. Use gun on head. Operate gun. I knew that. You need to think in 4D, guys. <laughs> God. Yeah, it's like COD. That's why COD lost its Kirk, because he had three di two-dimensional thinking. I wish this was a game I had to think in 4D. You know, there's a game that they made called Future Wars, which Matthew, somebody, Matthew or somebody else noted in the past, which was such a great game. Future Wars, Adventures in Time. No, no. But now it probably wait, sucks. Are you, did you... It's not this one. What it's the next one, right? No, that leads into the. No, no, no. It's after this. Oh, okay. This yeah. is their hallway. That's right. Use authorized mission on mailbox. Yeah. Give that guy his free copy of this shit game. <laughs> it makes no sense. It's not even a free copy of the game. It's just a mission. It's, it's a fake. It's a fake mission. It makes it's, it, you, it's it's like a, it says ma but it said like mail in to get Delphine games though was what it said on the mission thing it didn't really say that no well whatever um so there should be an outlet there the fuse box oh yes the fuse box sorry yes so you have to use your razor on the fuse box use depression on self that's funny use to why am I doing this? That's, that's the expansion pack for the game. Operate the fuse box, maybe? No. So, use the electric r cable on the... Oh, he said operate, operate the electric razor. That's, all, that's what Matthew says. Before you do that, you have to use the electric cable on the electric plug. Oh. Okay, where's the electric plug? Is this is here? Is it in this room? Use electric pl oh, cable. Oh, here. It's here. Plug. plug to the right of trash. What? Why am I doing this though? Make sure razor is on. Use razor on trash can. Last time I used the electric razor, it gave me a message. I don't. I did this. I don't know. Shave the trash. <laughs> now operate the razor on the trash can it says operate the razor on the trash can oh maybe maybe Luke Skywalker shows the razor's supposed to be a recording device isn't it um, I, I thought so you put the razor in the garbage that's it yep and now you go into the next room what's the point of that I don't know I don't know. I don't understand what the point of any of this was. Maybe I would have seen afterwards when I lost. Yes, you're good. You know what? Playing games with walkthroughs is not fun. You, you know what? Playing this game is not fun. <laughs> Let's be honest. It's supposed to be a recording device always asleep, so maybe we're recording something. How would you, but, okay, and without the walkthrough, how would you have known that, Sue? How maybe would after you we die, it'll be like, oh, Bond, you almost won, but you didn't record them or something, and then we'd have been like, yeah, oh, okay. okay. I, I, I don't, don't know. think so. I don't think so. It's never done that all along. It's not going to start now. <laughs> well, all I got to say is, at least I was able to beat the arcade sequences. <laughs> Yes, that was that didn't, impressive. That didn't, that didn't help with the walkthrough, so... That was, impress <laughs> that was impressive, because I probably couldn't have done that, so... Those looked really hard. <laughs>
just like so cartoony. Yeah, I was expecting the road runner to just go by and go beep beep. Yeah. Beep beep. Yeah, take off, will you? Take off. The end. <laughs> Should be the end. It's not. <laughs> Could you imagine if after all of this, the ending doesn't even have a cutscene, it's just credits roll? But the truth is, the end of this game should be an apology. It should be like, <laughs> like, we're sorry. We know we were assholes this whole game. Please forgive us. Like, please don't, like, please buy, like, buy more of our games. Don't, like, completely throw us away. That's all, I mean, they, they have to apologize. I'm assuming this is going to be an apology at the end. So there's a bit of stuff you have to do in this room. Oh, sure. Mm -hmm. Oh, what happened? We should have a transmission of the stealth. Are you going to read those? Target approaching, firing corridor clear, radar program operating at 100%, all systems green, over. Don't move, Mr. Bond, or I'll shoot. Do you want help? <laughs> no. Can I, like, use the rocket? I don't have any, like, to burn it, do I? Do a cigarette case, no matches. There you are, Mr. Vaughn. You are going to witness the birth of a new world. Yeah, if it doesn't work. Have you ever any... Okay. Uh... Can... Well, elastic band, I can snap it in his head face. I'm gonna pick this up for a reason. <laughs> no? <laughs> no. This isn't tossed in powers. Then why the hell do I have that? It was so important for me to pick that you, shit up. You you actually need it <laughs> really? for an upcoming scene. You think you're still helpless and able to do anything? You better hurry up. The town's going down. A voice out of the trash can where you wisely put the razor starts talking, thus creating a diversion. Okay, you're right. There's no way I'd ever be able to figure that out. I mean, like, there's no... Exactly. It's, it's, only so clued, it's only clued if you do it. Not, not if you don't do it. Yeah. So do you want to uh, destroy in five seconds? Uh oh. Five. What destruction? Don't move, Mr. Bond, or I'll shoot. Again. Auto, do something far. I can't locate the location of that noise. Three. Don't shoot, Mr. Bond, but that's great. Two. Don't shoot, Mr. Bond. <laughs> Zero. Haha, -ha, it was a joke. It's you, Mr. Bond. You were wrong to show up. Don't what? I guess that was my time this to do it. all over the place. Look, it's just stupid. Last of courage is due to you. I was, trying to, I was trying to attack him, but it wasn't letting me do it. Between your two eyes? Who says that? Who's, wouldn't it be between your eyes? He puts a bullet between your two eyes. I would hope Bond has two eyes. <laughs> Rocking a bottom right computer. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, that's what you have to do. You use the red bomb thing. How do I do it? Just use like use paper, throw the paper at it. <laughs> uh, quickly use red cigarette on computer. After computer blows up, quickly operate auto. Ooh. What the hell? Is Bond's gonna make out with Otto? <laughs> What's happening? Where? How do you know which one's a red cigarette and which one's a blue? That's the question. Did it work? I have to take the paper take out the paper first. Like, you know, it's it's like 
Why would, why would I think that like a piece of paper could be a rocket? It never says anything. Oh, actually, you know what? Matthew's right. This was a gold band. And um, the rocket one. You see, they fucking lied. It says the cigarette case contains two types of cigarettes. Rocket launching cigarettes and fingerprint revealing cigarettes. The rocket launching cigarettes have red bands and the fingerprint revealing cigarettes have blue bands. And the one I used is a gold band, so it was probably a regular cigarette. So that means he just lied. Why does the cigarette case not contain only two types of cigarettes like this in the manual? They lied to me. I wish I had more of a voice to complain about this war, honestly. So this is a gold ring. That one is a red ring. Okay. So that one you're supposed to use. Do, 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 do. <laughs> You fire your explosive cigarette at the central computer, which monitors and controls the whole island, especially its stabilizers. Without it, the whole place should be in serious danger. What's happening? Otto, do something. Blah, blah. What? What's flying all over the place? Oh, is that the it's rocket? the rocket, I think. <laughs> oh, okay. Do something bad. That's the explosion it did? Wow. I was supposed to operate him, I forgot. I was just clicking on him. There's no! the explosion. <laughs> he has destroyed the main computer of the island. We're doomed! You will get what you deserve, Mr. Bond. Shoot your red rocket all over that dirty well, so that, that cloud of smoke, right? It wants you to use Larry also. When he fights, like, with the rat or whatever, you know? For Mr. Bond, you will pay heavily for that. Julia will be my first victim. Who the hell cares? I don't care about Julia. Yeah, I, I never cared about her since she Look pulled at that. Gun oh, yeah, look at that. He grabbed her. Help me, James! Okay, help, help me! me. <laughs> Julia, hold... Julia, hold tight. I'm on my way. What are you doing? You gotta... Oh, okay. You're just walking randomly? I thought it was 326. It... Oh. What happened? It was at 326. It all blows up or whatever. I don't understand now. Oh, my God. This just gets more and more stupid. Is there a place supposed to put the CD? Yeah. Where? There's a compact. There's a CD player on the, the somewhere here. There was, there was no time to do it. Yes, yeah, CD. I know CD. I was trying to do it. All right, I gotta go back. Blu-ray. <coughs> I, mean, I can see where it is now. Examine. Computer, even spider. Yeah, so oh, here, oh, I player. see where. Yeah, right there here. it is. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Yeah. They remind me of the assholes from uh, from Spaceballs, the the people on the computers. How many assholes we got on this? <coughs> Yo ho! What can I punch out of right now? But I can't. I can't do anything. I love how he's just flinging around in his chair like a maniac. It's such a great, like, wonderful, like, rocket that I have that goes completely the wrong way. I was trying pure luck at that thing. <laughs> you know? There's, like, so little time here. Help, James. Help me. Screw you, bitch. I mean, Julia, hold tight. I'm on my way.
What happened? Uh, it 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 didn't register your click. What? I couldn't do it again. I was trying to do it again. It didn't let me. Oh, this game sucks so freaking bad. Like you're telling me exactly what to do, and I still can't do it. Why can't I, why can't I shoot the rocket right now? By the way, what's you stopping me? Maybe you can. No, you can't. Don't move, bot, or I'll shoot. That is dumb. So yeah, when you when you click the CD player, you were slightly to the left of it, so it didn't register it as the CD player. Why does he start left. walking away the left of the screen for no reason? I don't know. I don't don't ask me. I've been trying to understand. It's your fault. You programmed this game. You admitted you used to work for Delphine Software, didn't you? This whole thing has been a ploy to get me to play this game. Me? This is all your never, idea. I've never played this before. I never even recommended it to you. You somehow you did. Yeah, okay. <laughs> that my I still What, what can't happened get now? Over. What, I, what happened now? I still can't get over that uh, what, 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 what did what did the f <laughs> what, what happened? I don't, I don't know what happened. happened. I have no idea what happened. This game is more buggy than Cyberpunk 2077 <laughs> at this point. Um, no, I still, I, st I still, my favorite stream of yours was the one where you were bashing uh, Secret Agent when Apogee was in the chat, the creators of the game. <laughs> and I'll never, <laughs> I'll never forget. They got so upset about it. I don't mean to do examine. Use. Cigarette on a computer. I wasted time though. Is the time is still ticking away? They give you like almost no time. You see what it said? Before you can do anything, he shoots you between the eyes. Why? That's... Why? What? That doesn't make any sense. I, I know. Like, are you, like, you're like a millionth of a second to Matthew, do it? Matthew, Matthew says you have to click on him ASAP. But I was clicking... The first time, I was clicking really fast, and it didn't work. So the second time, I tried to click a little bit slower, and it was too slow. Wait for voice from Razor. It says, "Oh yeah, that's right. You have to. You have to. Yeah." I did. Not true. I waited for the voice of the Razor. Right here. And I clicked. <sighs> That's me. That's me. Like, just try to press the buttons too fast. Use cigarette. Uh, computer. No, you have to wait until it goes to zero before you use the cigarette. You do? Yeah. That's what you did the first time. If it goes to zero? Yeah. Why? I don't know. But that's 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 what per that's that's what you did the very first time, and uh, no. you you never died. I don't know. That's working now. Okay. Well, whatever. I can't save. Help me, James. Help me. We don't care about the voices right now. Let's just get past this fucking scene. <laughs> I, I was just making up a, a joke. There. Oh, no, he what? Just, he, just, he just froze. He just froze and waited until the time runs out. <laughs> I'm sure that failure. That doesn't make any sense. Well, at least you got it saved right there. <laughs> Why is he walking to the left? Stop walking. I don't. 
Thank God it pauses the game when you go into your inventory. Could you imagine if it didn't? There. Oh. oh. <laughs> what? <laughs> Time me out. What the fuck? The, uh... <laughs> you know, I do want to kind of recommend this game to Olav, though. <laughs> yes! I really do. I really do. <laughs> <laughs> Don't okay. love. You insert the compact disc in the CD-ROM player. Now the stealth won't have radar cover anymore. It will now be easily destroyed by the proper agencies. In hey, one second. Help, James! Help me! <laughs> like, you're on your own, oh, Julia. I'm going way. home. Stupid, stupid skank! Come out of here. Julia, I've had enough of this. This is all a bunch of crap. I'm going home and watching porn on my cable TV. What else did you do? Now? Through the door here? Did you, did you save your game? Yeah, I did save my game. All right. I believe so. <laughs> what? <laughs> Too bad you shouldn't have succeeded in countering the plans of the diabolical Dr. Y, but your lack of cool lost the game for you. What did I do? I don't know. You fucking... <sighs> Bond farted and the whole thing blew up. <laughs> I love how always wrong with this from game? Being, always asleep went from being game of the year to ha ha ha, this is so bad. Go get out of there. So you have to go to the helicopter. Uh, move, your, move your ass, Bond, for the place. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, good. Okay. Everything falls in around you. I've got to get out of here, you think? No. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Is that Luke Luke's Skywalker and Oprah Winfrey? She's a hail otter. She's unconscious. Oh, that's Julia? Um... I can't do anything. Jump! Oh! Wow, did I actually do that? <laughs> I knew that it was an automatic. What? So, this is where you'll finally get to use the rubber bands, dude. <laughs> was that... Was, did I jump on it, or was that automatic? That's what I want to know. It was a cutscene. So I clicked on it. No, it was a cutscene, because... Uh, yeah, it was a cutscene. So Dr. Y is flying a helicopter, and I'm hanging on to the bottom of it? Look at me, I'm smiling or something. So I just jumped off? You were supposed to... I was supposed to do something? Yeah. I was trying to save the game! You have to be really fast at this. What was I supposed to do? I used the rubber band on the helicopter. I'm not even joking. This is so stupid. What? Yeah. I see it the game, right? I think uh -oh. so. No, I see the game after this, isn't it? Yeah, I didn't. I thought you did. I thought I did too. I swear I did. Unless this is the save after you did it. I thought I saved it like after I... Oh, there was no opportunity to save it. That's right. It was a long cutscene. Oh, yeah. You, there we go. And I got stuck. Well, that's, that's not even the first time. I got stuck on there. I wasn't able to get out in time. Hey, Hopster Key. Um, I'm losing my mind, basically. That's what's happening. We're, we're, we're playing one of the best games ever made according to Always Asleep. This is the worst game ever. So what happens if we don't use the elastic? I bet you still can win the game. I don't think so because the elastic band is... He's, okay, so he's got a bomb on the helicopter and he's trying to take him to Washington. 
the Mercedes, you, you can still survive, can't you? I'm probably not. Oh, the whole purpose, 007, is to save everybody, not just yourself. Don't be greedy, 007. This is double as shit. It. Still can't see it here. So I get one millisecond to use the. Well, they're smart like a bunch of fools. I would be careful saving this because if you save it and they just fall right after, then that's. Help. Like what? Last, yeah, on the on the bomb. Or oh, the bomb. Let's see what happens. I want to. I want to see what happens. The sharks are ready. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Free the guard. You tied up. If you fall, what's with really, what's with James Bond? Like, why is this so weird? So just like, can I like use the? Rubber raft air. Yeah. Operated probably. Did you use the rubber band on the No, board? I did it. I just want to see what happens. We did it. Now we, <clears throat> no need to be scared. We have finally gotten rid of that crazy Dr. Y. Our mission is completed. Are you sure, are you James? Me? If I were you, I wouldn't count your banana skins before they're peeled. That's a Santa Paragua saying. He's destroyed all of what? What? Uh, uh what? <laughs> what just <laughs> happened there? Uh, it just repeated the same sequence. Where's the bomb? He's gonna probably throw it on you. <laughs> yep, there's the bomb. Nyar, 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 bomb. <laughs> Hold on, what? <laughs> what is nyar? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even sober enough for this. It's like Snarf Snarf from like Thundercats. I don't know. <laughs> this is insane. Nyar, 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 bomb. I still have an ace up my sleeve. You're going to pay for this. What? How did how did the how did the bomb get above the helicopter? Okay, so that's that explains why we why we use the the elastic band. Oh my god! So I guess the elastic band will will will, will make it stuck to him. And then he won't be able to Pretty release it. Much. That's the idea. <laughs> yuck, 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 yeah. I guess that's the uh, ja That's the uh, French version of yuck, yuck, yuck. At least I understand why I'm doing this now. They gave me a reason. Is there a lot of a lot of static with my voice right now, or no? You're fine. Okay, because on my end, my mic is really fucking up. You sound fine. All right. Keep forgetting what to do here. York is a French slur for British people? Maybe. <laughs> no trot area. No worry anymore, Julia. Everything is okay. We need to be scared. <laughs> we we no need to be scared. We have finally gotten rid of that crazy Dr. White. Our mission is completed. Are you sure, James? If I were you, I wouldn't count your banana skins before they're peeled. That's a Santa Paragua saying. So I was gonna try to drop the bomb at us to blow him up instead. How did the bomb end up above his helicopter before? That's what I want to know. How is an elastic band pointer? Because they can't drop it, that's the whole thing. You're gonna like arm the bomb and try to drop it, but it's gonna blow him up instead. That actually makes a little bit of sense. So, like, that's why doing things in a walkthrough is bad, because if it clues you, then it's, like, reasonable. It's a, I never would have had the elastic band without the walkthrough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I said? 
I never would have had the elastic band without the walkthrough. This is the bottom of the seaweed, remember? It took us forever to find it. Yeah, it, you, that's what I'm saying. This game cannot be beaten without a walkthrough. I, I said that all along. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bound. I still have an ace up my sleeve. You're going to pay for this. <laughs> well, shit. How strong is that thing? Well, it was at the bottom of the sea. Maybe it belonged to SpongeBob. Oh my god. Are you gonna like kiss or something? It, wouldn't nope. there be helicopter parts <laughs> falling down on top of them here? <laughs> They'd be impaled by the blade of the freaking chopper. What country is this? I guess Santa Power. Is that Leisure Suit Larry? <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> Matthew is closure. <laughs> I do too. It's called Never Playing This Again. We're seeing it again. You're welcome, Matthew. We're not done yet, are we? No. Read it before it disappears. Mr. Mr. Bond, in the up. name of the free people of Santa Paraguay, I have to date. I told you to be I fast. I knew that was going to happen. Fast, fast! I already declared declare that today will be a national holiday to commemorate James Bond for... <laughs> <laughs> That's you, Mr. Bond, that country will live in... Is he was... Uh, oh. What? Who's... Oh, he's so... That's James Bond, I guess. Yeah, that, that's Ooh, look at that. Oh. It looks like Superman King with that for Oh. Oh, James! Shake it, not stir it. Wait, wait a moment. I need to, I need to close the blinds so that we can have sex. It's not allowed to be seen in this crappy game. You want that to was the most the James Bond-like thing in the whole game. Was the very end. Aren't these people like embarrassed to have their names in this thing? Are seriously? Are these people embarrassed? Probably. Even if they're not dead. Paul Crusade re re made her game on Kickstarter a couple of years ago. Oh. I'm my money back too. Jean Pierre Fonte. Fonte. Jean Pierre Fonte. Fonte. <laughs> <laughs> the true masterpiece. Oh my I God. am responsible for the Clear the hello. Clear the hello. How about goodbye? Clear the hello. Maria Flaboni. Is that it? And that's next to the DOS. Like, C Bond. Let me tell you this, This is a terrific masterpiece, okay? This is number one. Look at this. This is the. Delphi T.O. Yeah, should agree to tie with James Bond. Yeah. You freaking liars. You do not have a agree to tie. In our next adventure? Why would we want to see another you one? You tried to do this to me on purpose. What? They did this to us on purpose. There's no pretend you tried to make this good. You, you, I didn't even recommend this game to you, dude. I didn't even know about it. Don't you remember? Oh, you didn't know about it? I was yelling at you. I was yelling no. at them. I was yelling at them just now, not you. Delphine Software had said, oh, oh, we tried hard to make this a good game for you. Bullshit. Jeez, oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. It... It doesn't. It didn't feel like a Bond game. That's the only, the, you know, the only decent thing about this whole game was the music. Except all the music was at the wrong time. Aside from that, it was good music. And I, and, and like this guy D. Morais, he must have like lobbied to put his na his like name on the front screen. Like why? He should be so freaking embarrassed. Listen, I played Out of This World. Out of This World is one of the best games I've ever played. My toilet is gonna need a plunger. This after. is one of the worst ever played for sure. I can't say for sure it's the worst, but it's so goddamn bad. Yeah. <laughs> Always asleep. <laughs> High five, buddy. Always asleep. Perhaps the real stealth affair was the friends we made along the way. It's a game of very nice. Oh my god. Very nice. 
Oh my god! Oh my god! Best bomb game ever. My tools get flunger after this. <laughs> yeah. Flashback I never played. I, 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 after this, I don't think I want to play it, Matthew. No, Flash. Okay, don't don't say what what's wrong with Flashback. Flashback. No, I didn't play game. it. I don't know, but like these guys made it, so it must be shit, right? No, 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 no. Flashback was actually a good game. Um, it's hard as hell, but it's good. How do I kill this freaking music? Um. Oh, I know F10. Oh, look, pause. Holy, they took away yeah, their options. Even, it's just pause now. Even, you can't even exit the game. We're liars. Oh, this Wish you a great time. Right? Yeah, you can't exit the game. This is, this is, this is torture. This, this is what this is. This is just torture. All right. Well... Summary, summary. <laughs> I, <laughs> Matthews is uh, offering Chris. <laughs> you can go first. You guys are so funny. Right? I, you guys, you guys are the best, uh, the best uh, viewers, the best chatters. You guys are so freaking funny. Sir, Sir Spangum says, "Stupid computer games. <laughs> this dumb fan this won't, dumb catch fan won't catch on." Yeah. Oh my God. Operate and install. Yeah, games. operate and install is right. Uh, dumb fan. Oh my god. Yeah, it's a good idea, actually. Let's do that. Hold on. Just have some closure here. And what what are we doing? Uninstalling? <laughs> <laughs> here we go. <laughs> Alright. That is it for James Bond Install the Fair. We're never playing this game ever again. It's one of the worst games I've ever played. It's just Terrible, 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 terrible. Thank you all you awesome people who suffered through the whole freaking thing. First of all, my wingman, Gamers Grotto. Thank you very much. You should check out his channel as well if you want to see more horrible games. <laughs> oh, what are you talking about? I play good games, okay? <laughs> and I'm telling you. Thank you, everyone else. Thank you, Matthew, who like, basically picked me up and like carried me through the end of the game with his walkthrough. Because I never would have gotten there without him. So, even though I don't like spoilers, they were justified this time. So, thank you, Matthew. And thank you, the rest of you guys, for your incredible humor. Always Asleep, Miami Sunrise, Sir Spankums. Oh, my gosh. I'm, like, dying from, like, all this craziness. Oh, my God. Who else was here earlier? I don't remember anymore. But, like, tons of people were here, I feel like. Like, Johnny Bond. Jim was here at one point. Hops or Key popped in. Stars Manny popped in. A lot of people are here. I'm not going to go through the whole freaking list. Just like, oh my god. This game was so bad. We're never doing anything like it ever again. If I ever see a Delphi game again, it'll be too soon. We're going to find a better game for next time. But thanks here's, everybody here's, for being here. Three hours thing, and 34 though. minutes of this pain. Here's the thing, though. Some of the other Delphi game games are actually quite good. This well, is just a stinker. We're, we're never going to know about it. it. Because this game is just so bad, we can't we can't take it anymore. No, I yeah no I know I agree. It's it, it's one of the worst uh, games I've ever seen. Um, but no, Delphine has made some good games. I feel like this is before they they made their good games. I don't know, but it's two twenty a.m. Thank God tomorrow's Martin Luther King Day, so I don't have work. Although my kids do have school for some stupid reason, so I have to get up and take them to school. But anyway, thank you everybody. Have a great night. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already done so. If you and tell all your friends that like these videos are so bad and like they should never watch them ever. So please save the world from this. And I think I think I'm deleting the channel too. So this might be your last chance to watch this video. <laughs> I think all of us should now go find Delphine Softwares because uh, I'm pretty sure they still exist in some form, and we should just spam it and say, you know, that James Bond game you made a while ago. We have words know. for you. I'm done, guys. Have a great night. You guys are all awesome. We'll do this again Take care, soon. guys. But not with this game ever again. Never, ever again. <laughs> Good night, everybody. Take care, guys. Thanks, Gamers Grotto.